All right, DM, As what he takes this hammer, it, boom, slams into you. Unbelievable. The might of a thunderbolt courses through your body. The armor you are wearing glows with a, a bluish purple hue as this bolt crackles through it. You feel your life being drained from you. This is it. This is this is the end of Baps Blinker Day. Ba Hello, everybody. Welcome to the Borderlands. Um, oh God. Uh, <laughs> hold on, I gotta change this music real quick. Uh, is this it? Yeah. Hi, I'm I'm your DM. You may know me from such hit films as the last episode. Uh, our advertisement for t today is uh, from Susan, uh, Saucy Susan's Secret Sauce. It, is your pasta bland? Your dog begs for leftovers? Well, we'll c c pop open a can and introducing Su Saucy Susan's uh, Secret Sauce, made with a mysterious blend of quote-unquote love and probably ingredients. Uh, uh, it'll have your taste buds tap dancing the Macarena. There's more on this ad read, but I'm not going to read it because we need to jump straight in. Thank you. Saucy Stan. <laughs> Hi, <everybody>. Bravo. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Um, we last left off with the rum, uh, with a, a pretty climactic battle between uh, Droga and Ragnar, which then spilled into Ragnar and Droga temporarily teaming up against Talos. Um, having joined in on the fray, Talos last mentioning that uh, this roaring storm here to the north um, was currently being dealt with. Uh, he was in, in a tussle with Ariel uh, when Fafnir came crashing down from the sky, uh, causing quite a ruckus. He's going berserk kind of in the center of this, and Talos had some time to teach some boys some lessons. And some lessons he did teach as he beat the absolute fuck out of both of them. Uh, man, it was, for those who weren't here, it was crits all the way down. Like, the, 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 at the very beginning, he critted, I'm, I shit you not, like eight times in a row. It was unbelievable. Uh, it, they were very narrative-heavy roles. Um. And as Talos was getting his scripts on, is I did have my scripts on all my beautiful scripts that I, you know, I control roll 20. Hey, you who's watching and playing roll 20 right now, roll your die. That's right. It's a one. That was me. That's got to be somewhat. Somebody's got to do that. Somebody. Right now. You've got a 5%. Somebody's losing their person. shit. Somebody's losing their shit right oh, now. Oh, I just oh, want to oh, say oh, that Talos taught double us. Ones. Oh, no, double ones. Double ones. Double ones. I'm rolling one. <laughs> um, and as Talos lifted up Droga, having beaten Ragnar to death, uh, well, as as death as a, an immortal being can be, uh, he began to lift Droga up, strangle the life from him. When he heard a song coming from the distance, a song that was playing on the radio, uh, and it was this one. As ripping through the ice and wind, the rumbler <laughs> smashes up a ramp, flies through the air. Talos has just a moment where he looks at it with just sheer confusion as the car smashes into him. When it does, uh, Muse, who was in her seatbelt, it breaks and she goes flying in the air. Cracks of heads, knocked unconscious. Sorry, Dustin, you're not here. That's the go-to. <laughs> Should have put your seatbelt on. Should have put your seatbelt on. But as the jostling happens, El Chad and Ansel in the back and Zinn are sort of shaken away by this thunderous hit. Um, they only have but a moment to respond uh, before suddenly 
uh, Bloco smashing on the accelerator and hitting the boost button begins boom, causing the rumbler to charge forward with unbelievable speed and just fury, ironically, and smash into the uh, the wall of this thing. <laughs> I need everybody to make uh, deck saves who are in the vehicle. Whew. All right. All righty. Uh, don't forget, well, is El, Ch El Chad's in the vehicle with us, so everyone yes, gets a plus five on these. Thank goodness. All right. Uh, deck save. It's actually Fish. seven. Uh, and then bingo. All right, we're gonna we're gonna turn that off for a sec. <laughs> uh, I'm actually going to uh, clear the initiative really quick so we can have kind of a fresh start. Wow. All right, everybody who rolled lower than a 12 uh -huh. will take nine points of bludgeoning damage and be prone. Uh, everybody who rolled above uh, will take half that and not be prone. Ooh, uh, Talos, on the other 13. hand, ooh, then Talos or then uh, Baps made it, and that's all plus himself. five from El Chad, right? Uh, yes, add a plus five from El Chad. Then he's so I think pretty then he's prone because uh, he was sitting in that seat that Horus cut the fucking belt. The seat belt. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, here. Uh, where's Vinny? Vinny, Vinny, Vinny yeah, got Vinny. the got five plus one plus five. Yeah. So he got eleven. He was. He was in Horace's seat where he yeah. cut the seatbelt off, so he goes flying. Um, smacks his head, not nearly as hard as Muse did. Um, but more importantly, Talos is just absolutely fucking smashed into this uh, cliff face. And he actually gets embedded in it a little bit. So right now he is basically under here. I'm going to put a little blue dot so that we know he's under that. Um, as the car is basically semi pinned him semi wedged him in here um he is uh he is basically staggered for a moment uh where i need everybody to roll initiative all right oh for those of us with two characters are we doing one or two? Oh yes yes so if you have two characters pick whichever one has the highest initiative roll and then both the characters will just act on that turn Oh, smart! Oh God, it baps every time. Hey, it's okay. We could be we we could hang out here at the bottom. Four and yeah, three. A lot of a lot of this is because you guys were jostled by the fucking car crash. Oh I, yeah. Oh shoot, I forgot to have my guy selected. I imagine I'm in a sense of shock. Him. Yeah. Oof. He's oh. way up there. Oh. Oh, please. Why? Why? Um, before we, we kind of jump into this initiative order, how's everybody in the car? Like, what's the atmosphere in the car right now? Well, the tunes were good until we hit a fucking you hear god. The radio, you hear the radio go, boom, 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 boom. You know that uh, you, you know that that moment uh, in the war film where the shell lands really close to the running guy and the whole thing goes real quiet. With the buzz. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that's tinnitus. probably I imagine <laughs> the tinnitus, right, or that shell shock noise. I imagine um, that the uh, I imagine that the tension is a bit high in the passenger seat of the yeah. front well, seat as I'm in Armad's lap. Yes, uh, you're in our med lap. I'll give um, him a I'll give him a I'll give him a pat. Bingo, you weren't jostled because when the accident happened, um our med was not necessarily holding you. I imagine he was <laughs> trying to strangle you if anything. 
But it was uh, like a seatbelt for me. Yeah, but more importantly, uh, Jeeves, great value our med, he grabbed onto our med to protect him, which sort of wedged you between them. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, that's good. <laughs> that was good. Now, I will say, whoever was looking forward when you crashed into the man, um, some of you recognize the man, some of you don't. So some of you know that this is Talos, and some of you do not. The people who went to Talonbrine do, for example, like Baps and Bl uh, Bloco. Uh, but people like uh, Horus wouldn't know. Right? Yeah. Or, well, yeah, it's Horus and Talos? Or Talonbrine? No, yeah, no, right. no like, Bingo wouldn't, is what I mean. Bingo wouldn't Bi know, yeah. Bingo wouldn't know, for example. Horus knows. Horus, oh, Horus, Horus knows. knows. And in fact, I'll say Horus and El Chad, both of you being paladins as you are, can just feel it in the air, like this divine energy. Um, and it is going sporadic. Um, it is very, very close, the one in front of you. But not only that, it is a, a good distance away towards that center of the storm. Um, and I'm going to play some music. As we, we hop into the top of the initiative, which is Ragnar. Or he gets plus. Ah, here it is. Oh, to fear. That's what I was looking for. Um, Droga, you are sort of <laughs> catching your breath, having uh, been strangled by a god. Um, but as that happens, you hear something behind you as Ragnar... Ugh. Oh, fuck. Um, as he is... Uh, that's it for his turn, as he is sort of rolling up onto his hands and knees and starting to get back up again. Um, he looks very angry, almost like he has some level of fury about him. Uh-oh. What's that? Um, Zinn, you have been jostled away. Um, you notice you have a little bit of blood on your head. You you uh, think that maybe you got hit with something when you were on the rock and were knocked unconscious. Uh, but you are now awake. You and Ansel, who is... <laughs> In the back. So Zinn's coming to... We've hit this thing with the car. Uh, what's the state of our windshield right now? Um, it is actually uh, pretty fine. That windshield is, is extremely heavy duty. So um, it is not cracked or anything. Uh, the front uh, bumper of the car is dented in pretty far, but it doesn't seem like it's affected the drivability of the vehicle. Okay. Um, what's the state of Talos right now? I don't think Zinn's ever encountered Talos before. Um, you can't quite see him. It's the equivalent of somebody being tossed and sort of smashed into something. So you see like a little bit of his arms, like his hands, basically, um, as he's grabbed onto the rocks to try and brace himself as he got sort of smashed in. You see like debris floating. Uh, okay. You, you... I will post this picture of him uh, so that when it is known, he is a, a fairly big guy. Um, you would assume that he maybe has a mm -hmm. half a foot over Baps, um, oh, kind of equally, equally rotund, you know? Okay. Um, Zin's going to just... To put Zin's... It the, the hands you do see, Zin, it looks like he could grab Zin's head and crush it. Okay, wonderful. Uh, this is gonna look around the car to see what the hell's going on. <laughs> uh, was it like on a rock? Yeah, does, does anybody want to answer what the, who the hell is this? Why are we fighting him? He is a bad dude. That's Horace's input. Okay, he's a bad dude. Okay, he's uh, a he's a false god. He's, he's trying to take Noel. 
Can we just give him nah? That's what are you saying? saying? What are you <laughs> saying? <laughs> <laughs> when that happens, um, uh, Nate, uh, Jeeves goes, well, we're not going to. Uh, yeah, that's what we said. <laughs> <laughs> Just changes it right <laughs> Okay. Yeah. Um, Zinn is going, is going to exit the car. He's going to back up to about here. Boom. And cast Minute Meteors. And that will be Zinn's turn. All right. I will say, Zinn, when you get out of the car, um, just as a just for reference, in case you need to know, the Rumbler has a pretty heavy duty door. So it like sort of pushes out and then slides to the side, this kind of reinforced door. Um, that's just something I want to say in case you guys need to know. OK, perfect. Um, it's a nice um, little adamantine turtle, basically. Excellent. And then, so is Ansel locked in a trunk right now, or? Yeah, so Ansel, you wake up in, basically, you know how, um, like, F1 drivers have those, like, four-point, or five-point, or whatever, six-point uh, seatbelts? Okay. Yeah, you're in one of those, like, this kind of full seat harness next to El Chad, um, and you are facing backwards um, out the back of the trunk. Um, there is a, a little thing you can pull to open the back of the trunk, or you can sort of clamber over the the seat you're in into the back of the car. Okay. Uh, he'll look around, see we pretty intentionally smashed into a guy and smashed him through a uh, cliff, and the guy seems okay. So <laughs> he's going to pop the trunk, come out to about here, and just aim at, basically aim at the spot with his... Uh, whatever it's called gun yeah the rat he's just gonna rattler, yeah rattler he's gonna keep the yeah he's just gonna hold an action to attack if this guy is fighting all right i will say ansel as you get out you see droga on the brink of death down here and a tattooed man uh muscular i do not believe ansel has met this person as he is sort of getting up um he is still prone he's basically rolled on his all fours and is is attempting to stand up probably on his next turn so in six seconds okay um yeah that'll be uh both their turn all right bingo resting in the arms of our men uh well the first thing that i'm gonna do uh is reassure our med that you know i think that uh you know i agree with you our med that we should uh, just give this guy nah, and I think that you and I should be friends. And uh, I'm going to get off your lap now, and I'm going to jump out of the car. <laughs> <laughs> and you jump out, and as you get up, you you hear, like, jingling. You feel like you somehow managed to break the hookah even more. <laughs> like, even though he's just remaining our men during that crash. I'm going to turn, I'm going to I'm gonna just sort of give our med a, a very... Uh, shitty grin, like, hey, I'm gonna give him a little wave. Uh, <laughs> love you, buddy. And then I'm gonna try and uh, do a little roll under the car here if I can to, to sort of hide. Okay, make I'll a. I'll put myself like here, but I'm I'm trying to hide. Uh, stealth, probably. I'm guessing. Yes, yeah, make it make a stealth check. Um, hiding under the car. 16. I'm going to put a little icon on you. This purple one. So that I know you're under the car. Um, that may come, come into play. Uh, is that it for bingo? Um, I think so. Uh, so now it'd be Talos is, turn after. Talos is, well, sorry. Uh, so Talos okay. is up on the, uh, up. He's not under the car, right? He's up on the, he got no, no, knocked no. He, back. So he is, in this cliff face. Okay, so he's inside the. Yes. So cliff in face. theory, you could stand on top of the cliff face. He is just in it, and I, I didn't have a good place of putting him. Okay, no worries, no worries. Uh, so yeah, so Horace is going to go too. Uh, Horace is going to uh, step out of the vehicle. Um, you know, look around, and be like, uh, "What's going on around here? Did we, we hit some? Hey, you guys, 
Floco, you hit this wall. He's gonna, he's gonna <laughs> no, stand here. No, I hit that gonna... fucking guy right there. I mean, he's gonna peer into the into the front and see if he can tell that there's like a hole and like a guy in the wall. Yes, there is a hole. Um, you see like the maybe the tips of his fingers. Um, Ooh. but you do see them move. Uh, as he is definitely not not slowed down by this in some way, right? Oh, he is, is alive and, and movable. I'm pretty sure he was guy? trying to kill Droga. Uh, all right. Well, you know what they say, guys, about um that. And he's gonna ready a warhammer action in case this guy shows up. Okay. El Chad. Uh, you wake up in one of those harnesses. Uh, you just see briefly as uh, Ansel sort of unhooks himself and opens the door to the trunk uh, and leaves. Uh, you had mentioned that we kind of get a divine sense from this guy. Yes. Is, um, is, is, it can... good, is it good or evil? Um, it is. It is not good. It's not good. It's not good. It's not good in the general sense, and it's not good in the Yasnik sense. Oh, okay. Yasni's like, this guy is a party fowler. Mm. Hey, hey, bro, it's me, Yasni. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's a party. Now listen, fighting outside of a hockey rink is wrong. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm not going to tell you what to do. Fighting inside of a hockey rink. Fighting There's a lot of ice here, man. Not wrong. <laughs> Listen, fighting yeah. outside of a hockey rink is wrong. And man, there's a lot of ice here. Okay. Uh. Oh. I just got logged out of roll 20. Somehow. Oh, did you uh, cast Beacon of Hope? I did that... cast Beacon of Hope. Use any number of creatures with Oh, man. Each creature gets advantage on wisdom saves and death saving throws and regain a maximum number of hit points if possible. Sweet. Damn it. I'm 10 feet out of it. <laughs> what? Wait, where do you pass? Well, where... It's within well, 30 feet. Well, because he hasn't moved yet, also. Yeah. I will point that out. Here, I'll, I will make it visible so that people can see. Ooh, yeah. You guys see that? Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Yeah, yeah. Droga, you're just going to have to come over here. Yeah. Oh, it's, it no, it's, it's, oh, it's because it's up to one minute, It right? moves with you, yeah. Okay. Yeah. It does move yeah. with you, I believe. But it's not an aura where it affects everybody. It happens oh, on it's... cast. You're right. Oh. Okay, Sorry, so, Droga. Uh, you have to pick any... No well, I guess everybody in this radius, then, is yeah. going to get all, the bestowal. All of my friends. Okay. All not of friends... Talos. Talos gets it because they're friends. No, I'm just... <laughs> <laughs> Um, no, literally everybody will get the benefits of this then. Um, you get advantage on wisdom saving throws Droga. and death saving throws yes. and regain the maximum number of hit points if possible from any heal. All right. That's a pretty rad fucking thing. El Chad's going to move over here and then his turn. All right. Ooh, there's Horus again. I'm deleting Horus. Yeah. Delete that Horus. <laughs> no. Um, Talos <laughs> is embedded in a wall. Uh, he is sort of shooken by this as he uh, and uh, is no longer that. Uh, as he begins to move, he, he is like, you guys can hear and somewhat see him just sort of breaking rocks around him by shuffling around and sort of pushing at them. Uh, and he is sort of regaining his footing. Uh, he's not doing anything yet. It seems like this thing has annoyed him at best. Um, actually, no. He's going to look in there and see Bloco in the driver's seat. And he's going to point at him. Loco's going to do like a who me kind of gesture. Who me? Moi. <laughs> and he looks at me. 
And it looked at him. You? Yeah. Okay, see so yeah. it. looks at me. And you look at him. And he looks at me. <laughs> so he uh he points at you, Bloco. Mm. He sort of trails his gaze uh next to you. Uh and looks at Baps and points at him. Um, is there anything on the front of the car that looks like on the front of the rumbler that looks like a weapon? Uh, there is. Well, if if you could see it, you couldn't really see it now, right? Yeah, I'm just thinking what I know from from seeing the rumbler before. You know that there's a grapple. A grapple. Okay. Um. You know, it's button three. I know it's button three. Do I think it's aimed towards him? Yeah, you could probably assume that. Okay, now the other thing is, what kind of action economy does it take to put it in reverse and try to drive it in reverse? Or does um, that fall under movement? <laughs> that would probably fall under movement, right? Because you're driving the rumbler. Okay. Then, uh, if possible, uh, yeah, I would like to try to shoot him with the grappling hook and then reverse. Maybe like I'm going to pick up Droga. I'm trying to think if it's more of like trying to drag him out of there with the grappling hook. But I think, no, Blake right. probably going to pick up, try to pick up Droga, even though that's probably not what's happening. All right, so are you shooting the grapple? I'm, sh I'm shooting the grapple, and then I'm also trying to reverse towards Droga. Not like to hit them, right. but to pick them up. Then I need uh <laughs> oh boy I'm gonna need an attack roll. It's gonna be a ranged attack roll. Um, it is unfortunately gonna be a disadvantage because it is a ranged attack. Uh, would I? I guess yeah, I would. You know what? Never mind. It's it's a flat roll because flat roll. Uh, because of Talos. And I probably don't have proficiency, so uh, just this minus five. Minus five? Eleven. Or no. Yeah, minus five. Twenty-one. I can't count. Twenty-one. It, boom, shoots at him. Uh, you hear it go off. Um, you hear a clank. Um, there's a lot of sort of sediment and dust that comes up, uh, but you don't know if it hits or not. And I just immediately punch it in reverse. Something. All right. Punch it in reverse. Oh, God, I picked up the rumbler but not the people in it um <laughs> and you start rolling it in reverse right back to where droga is uh bingo i need a deck save oh, no. oh yeah oh, no. he was under the tires or not <laughs> yeah i don't know if i would have seen that because i probably would just been locked on to talos <laughs> oh no the child He's good at it yeah and he wanted to get he wanted to hand over now so it's not like he doesn't deserve it a little <laughs> let's, <laughs> let's see it, bingo. I have a bad feeling about this. Bring it home. Wait, what do I have to do? Dex save. Oh, because you guys are running me over. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and you're not within uh, 10 feet of El Chad or Horus, or is the range longer than that? Oh, uh... Yeah. Five, yeah, it, it's no, they're not. They're out of range. All right, All right well, I'm, pretty bingo. I'm pretty dexterous, though. You're, like, hiding behind the tire. <laughs> Yeah, I was hiding behind the tire, though. And at the last moment, the tire begins squealing, and you're like, oh, shit! <laughs> Out of the way. Um, I imagine into this bush, maybe? Like, to just yeah, I'll roll into that bush. Uh, as you begin going backwards, uh, Bloco, you see the wire winding itself off towards, uh, towards it. And before you're able to hit the brakes... The car suddenly oh. locked to a, a stop. And the smoke begins to clear. And you can see Talos is standing on the grapple. Um, it looks like he lifted his foot and basically stomped on it. Um, as you feel like the car is tethered. As you're oh. revving backwards, <laughs> it is not moving. Yeah. That's about right. 
he's sort of like uh, standing upright. Uh, I'll say he steps out. Uh, he doesn't notice you, Bingo, or if he does, he doesn't seem to care. Uh, I'm just cowering at his feet, like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, when he when he steps out, uh, Ansel had a held action, so he's gonna take a shot. All right. Oh. Let's see how this goes. Jungle Rattler. I'm so fucking scared right now. Twenty-five. Yeah. Twenty-five will hit him. Okay. Uh, yeah, for 11. I don't think he gets the 9 because uh, Buddy over there is sneaking, right? Uh, no, he's within range, so it, it would get the sneak. Okay. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm within 5 feet. You <laughs> just start unloading on him. Uh, Talos uh, turns to you. Ansel. Yeah. He does not look bothered by this at all. <laughs> Just the bullets bouncing off him, basically. <laughs> basically. <laughs> he kind of just shrugs uh, that side of him where you shot. Um, you know, at most, you, like a bunch of tiny pellets hitting him. Oh, God. Um, Loco, what are you doing? That's your ripping backwards. Um, Is that it for his turn? Yeah, Blogo's gonna yell for Droga to get in the car, even though it doesn't mean anything right now. <laughs> I also want to point out, I imagine for everybody here, this is fucking terrifying. Yeah. Like, uh -huh. this is, and for Baps and Vinny specifically, like, this is the guy who apparently once not, like, and is just this horrifying entity. Yeah, so I think that's what Blogo does, and then. Vinny's gonna. <clears throat> he's prone. He's gonna become unprone. And then I think he's got. I mean, he's got like 15 feet of movement. So he's just gonna step out here. Uh, he's gonna go ahead and make use of that full healing thing to drink one of those 5d6 potions as an action to oh. get 30 HP back. Oh. Nice. Yeah, you heal max. So he's at 94 of 100 now. So that's nice. Uh, and uh, Vinny, Vinny's like, uh, he's determined, but his legs are shaking from a combination of the cold and maybe this, this big mean guy. Not uh, only is your leg shaking, but you feel Dimwan's is. God. As Dimwan is, is like, ah. Uh -huh. Fuck, 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 fuck. Okay, Vinny, this is bad. Yeah, it is. I'm really, like, no, no, this is really fucking bad. Oh, yeah, like, that's like. The motherfucker that. No, that's the motherfucker that slew a shitload of my demons. Like, a shitload. You don't understand. We need to go, like, now. It's okay, you know, um, demons, that's concerning, right? And uh, sure, I'll, sure, we're shaking a little, but that's that's got to just be the cold, right? Um, yeah, yeah, it's just the cold. It's you know, just look, the cold, but we should probably hurry this up, yeah? Yeah, yeah, look, it, here's the thing. If we take this guy down, in that ever flame, we'll be nothing. That's, that's true, that's true. I'm, I will be healthily optimistic. Yeah, and I will um, make sure to run if it's appropriate. Of course, of course. Um, oh, one last thing. Is Bloco continuing to back up? Like, I imagine the car is just in reverse. Well, yeah, I figure once it stopped, I mean, like, he's also, like, right there next to Droga, so it's not like he intended to go further. It just was a, a, quicker, a, bra a quicker break and unexpected, yeah. I imagine the tires did like continue spinning a little for like yeah. a second or two. Yeah. Um, and is that it for? Yeah, yeah, that's us. Uh, We're done. All right, our men. Uh, this is the first time you're you're seeing a a god in person. Uh, how's he feeling about all this? Our man's pretty uneasy. He goes, 
Are we really fighting that thing? That guy, excuse me. Yeah, yes, are we? Are we really fighting that thing? Hmm? Yes, that's what I said, Jeeves. But uh Yeah, I yes. was yes, I uh, I was uh, backing you up, sir. It Here's what I want so. you to do, Jeeves. I, I I want you to be smarter than me. Hmm. All right. I, I I'll I'll try it, master. <laughs> and then he, he he says it just like please do this, you know. Just yeah. uh just uh just he means, he means it like, it like be it. quiet, but <laughs> yeah. Well, you notice that he gets really quiet and he seems to have this look of pondering. Hmm. Hmm, yes. Hmm. hmm. That's that's basically the look he's giving. And then he says to Jeeves, he goes, "What do you think we do?" What do I think we do? I think we give the He looks at our med. He makes an insight check. Okay, okay, okay. I think we give the girl to the man. <laughs> okay, well, I I look over at uh, Babs right next to me, and then I look back to him, and I go, that's not an option right now. But, uh, yeah. you know, you, you're doing your best. Don't worry. Uh, I will get us out of this mess. And... Uh, I uh, I say follow me, so I, I hop out, yeah. and then uh, Yars, on the other hand, he looks out the window and does he? See, I guess he sees. Uh, our he boy sees right Ragnar. Here. Yeah, he sees and him then, getting uh, back up. And Yars sees Droga. I assume, yeah. Droga. Yep, he'll yeah. see Droga beat to hell. All right, but still standing. Still standing. He's going to pop out of this. And um, he's going to go. He's just going to say, I thought Ivar killed you. Yeah. Uh, uh, just a nasty fall. <laughs> yes. Good to see you. Uh, you notice Ragnar is is actually in a bit of pain. He's he's grabbed his stomach as he's sort of like on his hands and knees. Oh man. If you as much as I would love to get in an altercation with you once again, I'm in the process of dealing with some family issues. And he looks mm. over at Talos pissed as shit. Hmm. I don't know if Yars can put aside his rage especially since he killed he killed someone in our party yeah hmm so what's it going to be dwarf wanna Let's end see. it here and now he takes his axe and he holds it up over his head and then he looks over at Droga for like an, an approval see what see what what should we do Droga but, but he just says it with a look you know his his axe is raised If you need an extra bit of pushing, uh, Yars, I will say that, um, well, it, this isn't pushing. This is just what he's going to do. Uh, uh -huh. Ragnar sees you do that, and he is going to just be like, <laughs> come on, I thought you had more balls than that, dwarf. You know, if you don't stop me, I'm not going to stop. And then <clears throat> Yars, uh, all right, Yars brings it down. He he, he brings it right down onto uh, Ragnar's head, and he does it. Is this guy uh, prone? I assume he is. Yes, he is prone. Okay, well then he does it. He does it three times. Ragnar is so provocative. He is. He's he's Ooh. such an ass. <laughs> yeah, you. <laughs> hit him with the final hit uh, swinging down as he sort of sits up you stab him boom you hear bones cracking as you uh, drive your axe into his chest and he gives you this this smirk as he's bleeding out the sides of his mouth and he goes <laughs> oh, 
You're on a time limit now, dwarf. <laughs> Before he slumps back over. Um, it is at this moment in the distance you hear Fafnir and this burst of light. Um, it is enough noise and commotion to sort of draw Talos' attention for a moment as you see him turn away from you all and kind of look past where Zin is uh, towards the center of the storm. Hmm. Um, hmm? I was just going to say, does Yars know? Never mind. Never mind. Go ahead. Uh, no, I was I wasn't gonna say nothing. Never mind, just continue. Yars, uh, Yars just slew this guy. The dragon mm -hmm. calls out immediately upon the death, I assume. Yeah. And uh, Dallos recognizes that. Yeah. And then, uh, is there anything Armed and them would would want to do? I think they just walked out. Yeah, I think just to finish it off, Yars just says, he goes. One down, two to go, and then uh, uh, and then these guys just sort of. Uh, oh, let's see. I think. I think uh, these guys are going to hold actions for now. All right. Uh, and what action is that? Ooh, uh, they're going to hold a spell. All they're right. going to they're going to each hold spells. As we get to Droga, Droga, you saw Yars uh, sort of slew Ragnar again. Uh, well, this is your first time seeing it happen. Yeah. Uh, Ragnar is sort of slumped over on the ground. Uh, he has this kind of like relaxed smile on his face as he's sort of just laying in a pool of his own blood. As uh... Yars is going to see Droga. Hang on, let me see. Why can I not pull this character? Okay. Yars and Armed are gonna see Droga just slowly just limp over to uh, to Ragnar. And Droga's gonna pick up Ragnar and right. just scare just scare at Yars. <laughs> Yars just came in. Oh, were you were you like doing something here? Was this like a <laughs> No and all like the, an arc by, the way, for you? On, by the way, all the experience points go to Yars. <laughs> no, no. You see them in a in a lot of pixels, just like old Digimon. And he grows a foot taller. <laughs> no, but you pick up Ragnar. I'm gonna um, I'm gonna pick I'm gonna pick up Ragnar, and my intention is I'm gonna keep on hitting him, um, but I'm gonna drag him like drag him and then hit him as I go. Um, but I'm gonna look at Yars. What what kind of a look? Well, here, make uh, a. Uh... Hang, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. So like, so like, Droga, he's looking at Talos, and he's gonna look at Yars, and he's just picking him up, and he said, "That fucker is gonna be buried by the time we're done with him. You don't threaten Sigtir, you don't threaten my family, and you don't threaten us." Um, I will say, as Droga picks up Ragnar, um, unlike this last time when he got up. His wounds are healing, um, but extremely slow by comparison. Um, you can assume that he is not going to get up by his, you know, suddenly getting knocked down and then get back up again, uh, at least not for, for the day. Oh, for the day. This uh, You guys wouldn't know this, but basically his whole thing about getting knocked down and then getting back up in his fury mode, uh, Never gonna keep he only down. does it once per day um otherwise he's he has he recovers very slowly over the course of a day um but once it's done he's at full health so it has its give and take i'm i'm wondering if like we keep hurting him if it hurts the dragon well well, I'm not anyway, going to tell you what to do. As, with him. <laughs> as a as a bonus action, I'm going to a uh, I'm going to channel divinity, as I I'm going to like I'm going to drag Ragnar like by his hair, basically. Uh, all right, as, where are you bringing him? As I'm going to start going uh, away from the storm, 
Or maybe towards the storm. Hmm. Well, we need an answer. Come on. <laughs> okay. No, we're actually, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go towards the storm. Fuck it. But we're gonna go behind the car. Okay. Okay. As uh, we're yeah, I'm it's gonna a rumbler. It's a, it's whatever. It's a it's a horseless carriage. Um, I'm dragging him, and uh, I'm gonna heal two d six as as I as I do this because I cast aura of vitality. Oh, did you pass that con save last time? Um. From him strangling you. Uh, I. I do not believe you made one. No, I did make the con save. I made the con save. That's why I dropped a zero. Remember? Because I failed it. Uh, no, I meant the con save to concentrate. Oh, I couldn't. Con I wasn't concentrating on the spell. It was raging. Oh. All right. Well then, never. Yeah. It, 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 this is why I am. Um, uh, I'm doing it like I'm. I'm casting it again, and I'm using a a a. a, a was it a channel divinity to do it because yeah. I'm out of level three spell slots? The Toyota Rumbler. <laughs> Toy <laughs> All right. Um, All right. And that it for uh, Droga. That's it for Droga this round, yes. All right. Baps. All right. Baps is going to kind of shake himself, fix his helmet back up. His ears are still ringing. He looks at Bloco. Get, 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 keep, keep the thing. <clears throat> keep, keep the thing moving. Keep, keep, we gotta get that the hell out of here. Yo, right? Bloco, when you when you hit the uh, the reverse, it's just like just spinning tires. <clears throat> oh shit! We're Baps is gonna got us stuck. I, I, I'll handle it. And Baps is gonna open uh, this door on this side. That one's already open because our men okay. jumped out. Oh, so you're right. good. Both yeah, sides are out. open. They'll just yell out. It, it, Then he's gonna uh Talos Talos is gonna look at you, Vaps, and he's gonna like crack his neck and point. Yeah, Vaps is gonna I figured you didn't have the balls to do it. Maybe. Maybe not, you <clears throat> monster. But well, we've already won. You're you're not, <sighs> not getting what you want today. I never get what I want. I have to improvise because of what you did. All this, it's on you. Yeah, this is some, some, some big words from the guy doing it. You, you, you know, I used to work for, for people like you. Always, always saying that the, the terrible th things that they did was somebody else's fault, but they were doing it, and somebody's gonna stop them, and somebody's gonna stop you. <laughs> and Babs is gonna raise his halberd up and point it at Talos, and then bring it down, severing the chain. <laughs> All right. As you shiver the chain, uh, Bloco, the car kind of jostles a bit as you feel it uh, sort of come free. Uh, you are able to, to move unrestricted at this point. Um, but you you didn't have it in reverse because otherwise you did fucking Droga. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and he's had such a rough day already. <laughs> Droga uses Ragnar to cushion the blow. Uh, <laughs> he would he would entirely um Dallas I think he he kind of laughs a bit at Babs um and then he I'm not gonna use that filter again because it takes a long time for it to swap back and forth for some reason uh but he kind of <laughs> um and he's gonna snap his fingers and you see the hammer boom, return back to his hand what are you gonna do? Defeat me with the power of friendship? 
It's oh, not we're... like damn that. right. We're freaking <laughs> what? Around, we're he, gonna he no, turns probably and probably not. <laughs> <laughs> no, he turns and he fucking looks at B- Bingo. <laughs> No, no, we're, we're saying we're, that we're gonna r- run like hell. Yeah, I think you should. I got more important things to do here. I can't be teaching every hero what it means to mess with a destroyer. So fucking right. run. Well, I do think that that's actually Bap's turn. All right. <laughs> then. <laughs> oh, is Zen beer a bit? Yeah, I'm, I'm here. I'm here. Uh, Zen is gonna move thirty feet towards the car. <laughs> All right. Runs back to the car. Um, but he will hold an action to launch two. This is holding it to launch two of his meteors at um, Talos. If Talos tries to engage either the Paladins there or uh, the Hobbit. All right. And Ansel. Ansel's going to shoot and then move. Uh-huh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. Does oh, okay. 14 hit? Uh, it does not. Okay. Now Ansel's going to move. Um, back. Hold on. Okay. Before Ansel moves, <laughs> Talos Wonderful. very quickly. Right up to to Ansel, basically squaring now, up with him. Does uh, that does that provoke an opportunity attack from Bingo or no? Because it's a it, special. It will. It will now. No! Bingo, do it. No! Do it, Bingo. Oh, Bingo. Do it. Bingo. Bingo is going to attempt to stab, uh, uh, Talos, right in the gooch with his. Displacement dagger. <laughs> okay. No. Oh. All right, Bingo. Nineteen. You, you uh, you're kind of taken off guard at how fast Talos moves and just barely kind of miss him. And by barely, I mean it actually is a bit more than barely. Um, <laughs> T- Talos. Um, actually, you know what? You guys can see it. He takes the hammer and swings it forward, which is why he's able to basically launch himself as quickly as he is um till the point that he's basically squared up with you ansel and uh he's looking down at you and he goes want to try again or are you done with your little pea shooter uh-huh. i'm good man <laughs> um i'm going to I guess with my bonus action, hunting action to disengage and then move back. <laughs> All right. 30 feet. <laughs> Talos is just kind of like, as you as you walk away, you're maybe a little uncomfortable because he does move the hammer a bit, but then you realize he's just kind of twirling it in his one hand. <laughs> and that'll be it for both my characters. Zen is sweating. Yeah, Zen okay. doesn't. Zen isn't about this at all. He's just trying yeah. to cover his friends. <laughs> all right, Bingo, you just whip hitting a guy. All right, Bingo is going to Bingo. Bingo, there is a log next to you. That's important. Is, Bingo is going to attempt to fart. Yeah. All right. <laughs> now here, here's the thing. I told you, I watched that video again because we had it on short. Yeah. <laughs> you can just do it as an action, but I am putting a, a little caveat in it. Okay. I need a con save. Now, this con save isn't to do it. This con save is to determine whether you shit your pants a little. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I con save. All right. 
Oh. <laughs> a, little, a, little, a little comes out. Now, do I shit out? Do I shit out the ring itself or just poop? No, no just a little poop. Okay. Uh, you are turned invisible, but you do kind of smell a little. All right, noted. And then I will, uh, I will attempt to shoot this guy with my magic bow. Okay. Let's see it. For twenty three. Twenty three. Here, roll again because you actually have advantage. Oh, and I and I have advantage because I'm invisible. Twenty seven. I mean. Hey. Yes, you will hit. You feel like right. you wouldn't have hit it before. Now, one thing that does happen is you are now very visible. Oh, I thought that it was a greater invisibility. I'm still no, it, I'm, it I'm is just regular again? invisibility. Okay, yeah, that would be a little op, huh? Okay, yeah. okay. <laughs> so I deal twenty-two damage. All right. I do aim for the ass if that is important. <laughs> you do, do, hit the hit the shots. They do hit him. They kind of just break when they hit him. Uh, you do, you know, do some damage. Uh, now, is probably the... more importantly, his attention is going to be drawn to you. Uh, I feel that I have erred. I'm going to well, run. Well, well. I'm going to run because I haven't moved yet. I'm going to run behind El Chad. And okay. is farting a. Is farting a bonus action. action for me? Oh, that's an probably, action to do. I he probably couldn't have shot, shot then. Well, well you were hidden. I'll say you were hidden. So okay. at least it, that makes the, the all of it kind of irrelevant, whether you were invisible or not. Because I was behind the log. And your pants are magically clean. You didn't okay. shit your pants this time. You, you <laughs> thought about what would happen. Wait, no, I shit my pants anyways just from fear. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, but, but, uh, so, so I guess I used my bonus action to hide already then to, to uh, well, no, you were already hidden. Okay. Okay. So you can use your bonus action to hide again. All right, good. So I'm going to, I am going to, uh, hide behind, uh, behind El Chat here. All right. Make that stealth roll. Damn. Hey, damn. All right. Talos turns around and as he did, I you like off. slid. Yeah, you scampered under this log and then dipped between their legs to hide over here. <laughs> Baps says, no, 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 big, big, big man. You and me right now. I thought you were turning tail and running. I mean, I mean, Seems maybe, like maybe. your friends have other ideas. We'll just have to see about that, won't we? I think we'll have to send a message. Don't you? Babs, uh... You know what kind I'm of. like. Um, and he, he says that referring to you saying you knew people like him, right? Mm -hmm. He used to work for him. Yeah. Baps waves him forwards. All right. Woo. Okay. Uh, is that it for bingo? That is it for bingo. All right. Oh, wait. Horace. Is Horace doing anything? Oh, yeah. Horace. Uh, Horace. I mean, does it look like. Does it look like we're trying to fight this guy, or does it look like maybe we're trying to to well, get away? You saw Bingo try shooting him I mean, in the ass. Bingo then, shot him in the ass, yeah. What, what does Horus think? Yeah, it's whatever Horus thinks. Let's see, what does Horus think? Horus is going to do an intelligence you can do a, check. You know what? I'll let you do a religion check instead. Oh, ooh, okay, okay. Where's my religion? Where's my religion? Oh, there it is. Oh no, I'm not proficient in my religion. <laughs> <laughs> I'll give, I'll give that you is advantage so on in your own religion. <laughs> that, that is so, so on brand for Horace. No, you, you're right. No, I, I, I love it because what he, is the 
what is the worst interpretation of Yasnik scripture that Horus could pull right now? Uh, I think that he thinks that I think that he thinks that Yasni would want him to convert this guy. <laughs> yeah, no. That, <laughs> I, I'm going with Zin's logic. With the yeah. moment Horus broke his oath, he forgot all Yasnik <laughs> scripture. Yeah. Oh, brand him. That's yeah. yeah. Hey, brand El Chad. Him. This is this is when we brand them, right? And I'm gonna <laughs> run up. Oh God. Yeah. No. No. <laughs> yeah, why don't you try that? To, uh, attempt <laughs> to, uh, yeah, go for it, bud. I'm going to attempt to just. You do it, would it bro. Would it be a Would it be a uh, improvised weapon to try and slam my holy symbol into his face? Uh, yeah, probably. All right, so that's just uh Well, I guess the attack is the same as my Warhammer, right? It's yeah. just strength plus proficiency. Okay, so I'm rolling this, but it's actually my brand. A 15. Uh, as you do, he just swats it out of your hand. All right. And, uh, and looks at Horus. However, then... I do, I do have my, um, I do have my extra attack. All right. So, no, no, no. Hold still. <laughs> and I try it again. All right. An 18. 18. Uh, again, he's, he, I'll say he grabs your wrist this time. <laughs> um, just for a moment, he, he has unbelievable strength. Yeah. Um, you know, Ragnar beat the shit out of you. This man is big and he is strong. Like he is as strong as he Ooh. looks. That um, is a firm handshake, sir. Yasni approves. And by the way, he had just said that we need to probably send a message thing to Babs. <laughs> oh, no. And Horace, uh, Horace, you did good. I'll say he looks at Babs and then looks at Horace and then looks at Babs, I guess, expectingly for him to maybe say something. Let him go. Oh, okay. Not, not you, Horace. Just get, 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 <laughs> Horace, <laughs> Horace, Horace, like okay. He get, he get, does get back to the thing. Talos does like let go of Horace. Oh, and sort of drops me. Yeah, he like lets go of your wrist. All right. <laughs> All right. And let that be a lesson to you. <laughs> this m m might be beyond us. For now, big man. But d d don't get don't get comfortable, just just yet. Talos is just giving you this cold stare. Um, it it's cold. You've probably seen stares like this in Gloomhaven, for example. It is this cold stare of like I don't give a fuck about you. Does uh DM does he look at injured whatsoever from the crash and from the fighting with with Ragnar and uh Droga? It looks like he, he's a little scuffed up from from that. Um it looks like he was injured um but probably not from anything that happened here. Oh right. Yeah, he was fighting a god earlier. Uh as we hop to El Chad. All right. Uh, the first oh, you, matter... you did move 20 movement, uh, Horace. If if there was any other movement you would like to do. Oh, I well, started, I am I, I am released. Um, no, because I don't want to provoke an opportunity attack. Okay. Uh, then, yes, uh, El Chad. All right, so the first order of business is do I smell... What a the certain somebody's cooking. yeah. What the rock is cooking? <laughs> <laughs> what? You smell what Bingo's cooking? <laughs> yeah. Do, can I smell what Bingo's cooking? Yes, hundred uh, <laughs> percent. Uh, okay. And it's a lot of sauce. <laughs> <laughs> Susan's secret sauce. That's right. Susan's Susan secret sauce. Name sauce drop. it up. Sauce it up. Susan's secret sauce. Well, I suppose I should just go after this guy. 
All right, I'll take that as a confident yes. Yes. Yo. It's you guys do whatever you guys want to do. Hmm. You know what? It's a good point. El Chad's going to hide behind this tree. And he's going to bravely sm- and valiantly. Bravely and valiantly and reach up over the tree with his arm for some flame whip time. I assume a 29 will hit? A 29 will hit. All right. Oh. Uh, oofa doofa. <laughs> I love the 10 kinky damage. <laughs> He gets whipped by it. Uh, He's into it. (laughs) He's super into it. El Chad is going to use the rest of his movement to dive into these bushes. (laughs) All right. That'll be his turn. All right. And then you didn't have the count here. The count went to safety, right? Yeah, the count's in safety. Okay. Then uh, it is it is Talos's turn. Oh boy. Okay, now I got to think about what he's gonna do. Oh. Sorry, I'm I'm like kind of spooked. Don't worry, like, you can kill Horus. <laughs> well, well, I'm I'm debating on what he's doing. Okay, man, don't put me on the fence like that. Don't just call me out. Uh, Baps, are you you're you're egging him on to you, right? Yep, Baps. Baps is very um ill-advisedly egging him on to him. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, he, he thought that people would get the, get the, get the picture and, like, maybe... <laughs> yeah. Maybe try to flee. Kalos is gonna go... And he's going to square up with Baps. Um, And Baps, this is, you know, again, kind of a a not a surprising thing, necessarily. um, Being that he is a god. Uh, But he's he's basically looking down at you. Um, Not by much, but by enough that it's it's kind of thing. And he's this big rotund guy and he sort of breathes a, a heavy sigh and he looks around. All right. Got anything to say? Being that it's your last fucking time talking. Well, I, you, you, you might get 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 me, f- f- fucker. But the the rest of us will be back. And, and you know what? Sh- she'll be coming for you, too. I don't care one of my little brats are up to. I've already had to change plans once. Uh, And he's going to lift his hammer. And as he does, Uh, Baps reaction uh, procs to swing a fucking blow at him. Alright. So Baps will swing a blow. We'll do a regular one. Just because I'm, I'm fairly certain that this... Yeah! Yeah. We're going to say they happen at the same time, basically. Yeah, uh, <laughs> nice. You whoop, boom, stab him. Uh, kind of in his gut. Uh, he, with his free hand, grabs it, like, as it's stabbed into him. And he's going to lean over. He gives you this look. 
crack of bolt or of lightning shoots down into the hammer. And Baps, he strikes you with it. Ooh. Oh wait, what the hell? Oh shit, what is this? <laughs> <laughs> I gotta read this. Give me a sec, guys. Uh I'll let you read it. I can't save or die. Holy oh, crap. Shit. Okay. Now, is he actually wielding Ushrat Kakur? That is the name Did of I pronounce it right? Yes. Did I pronounce it right? That is that it was good. That was actually right on fucking point. That was awesome. Holy Ushrat shit. Kukar, or Skybreaker is the dwarven for it. Uh, dwarven his guy. Does does yep. does he need to make a, a a hit roll for that first? Nope. He just hits you. Oh damn. Whew. Rocks fall. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I mean, he is, he is a god. Yep, yep. Sure wish everybody a had at destroyer. least... Hey, at sure. least you got, a, you got a paladin within 10 feet of you. You will get plus four to this because Horus is within 10 feet of you. Oh, goodness. <laughs> All right. You can do it. Everybody hold Here your breath. Go. Here we go. Here we go. It's 24. 24. Oh, oh no. <laughs> no. Wait. Wait. Indomitable. I always Wait. forget Indomitable. Yes. Oh. Uh, Domino gives you what? Reroll. You re-roll. Well, that would be the 22 already, right? It's technically no, a roll. Advantage. That That's... that would be a little <laughs> cheesy. Okay. Sure. <laughs> We've never yeah. well, well, So you well, got to roll a 13 or higher. That is basically yeah. the no, no, that's that's not gonna help. That would make him because it's that would against make him the, take the lesser roll. The lesser roll, which you don't want. No, Oof. I don't want to take the lesser roll, y'all. <laughs> All right. Oof. Here we go. Thirteen or higher. We oh, saved God. that silver rhubarbs. Oh. Oh, Thirteen or no. Oh, All right. Wait. Baps, this blow hits you with unbelievable might. I, I don't suppose Crap. I can use my second indomitable. <laughs> I don't know what is what does Indomitable say. You don't happen you to have a re-roll. bardic inspiration, do you? No. <laughs> okay, just check it. I always forget about Damn it. Damn it. Um. Uh, does it just say one? You can reroll a saving throw if you fail. If you do, it so, says you can you use it twice before between each long rest. So I well, don't. I think know that, that means the the amount of uses you have. Yeah, I think you have right. to take whatever. Roll you oh, I think it one, says if I recall. you can re-roll it. Doesn't it say like you can re-roll? It should say and must if take, you do so, you you must, must take, take the, the second, yeah the second sure roll. It does. Let's see. You can use this feature. If you do so, you must use the new roll. Yep. Okay. All right. Sorry. Sorry to break the drama. So. No. No. I mean, no, no. It was worth a shot. Pull out all the stops, guys. Hold on. Hold on. Question. 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 Question, because I have my reaction. Uh, I'm able to spend key points to, like, erupt some kind of, like, not quite wall, but sort of wall of earth to, like, lower damage. Uh, I think it's instantly slain. Yeah, I know, but I'm just wondering if if it would, since it's, like, lightning meets a little bit of dirt, if that might dampen it a little and... All right, guys. All right, be guys. like just instant unconscious instead I'm, of just full dead. Sam, 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 thank you very much, but I think we all just need to take a break. Yep. And We're ready. DM talk. We're ready. Let's take a break. Call Let's it take here. a breath. Take a breath. Uh, uh, all right, DM. As he takes this hammer, it boom slams into you. Unbelievable. The might of a thunderbolt courses through your body. The armor you are wearing glows with a a bluish purple hue as this bolt crackles through it. You feel your life being drained from you. This is it. This is this is the end of Baps. Blinker dead. Baps calls out one last cry. Just goes. 
And as Baps goes flying through the air, that armor he is wearing glows with runes and shatters. Um, when it does, unfortunately for you, Baps, the armor of plots has been destroyed. But you have survived. Oh, man. <laughs> that was the fucking old batch of armor he bought a long time ago. <laughs> Hell yeah. As you, boom, shatter, slide across the ground. Talos is kind of surprised. <laughs> fucking dwarves. All right. Fine. We'll do it the way you want to do it. And as he lifts his hammer up, a crack of lightning. And we are now, uh, we're in a fight. Oh. Do the runnies uh -oh. go off? We weren't in a fight before? Well, no. Talos no. was was He was just playing with super... us. No, we, we, were, we were trying to leave, and then everybody fought him. <laughs> well, I mean, yeah, there was yeah. initiative, there were attacks. I figured we were in a fight before, even though some of us were trying to leave. <laughs> Talos has gone from, uh, from mild, leave, yeah. right. mild bemusement to, uh, to annoyed, we'll say. He's not even angry. Um, as the storm around you crackles with lightning, um, as you can see Talos uh, sort of right himself, uh, and we are we are gonna do some stuff. What is what is Bloco doing? He just watched fucking poor poor Baps get absolutely destroyed. Well, uh, for this turn, am I able to like sort of? turn and back up so I don't hit Droga or ideally Jeeves and Armed. You can um sort of turn to the uh here I'm gonna turn your car a bit. Where is it? Oh god, I can't find the there it is. Yeah, because I'm thinking you can basically either... back up to to like here basically. To yeah. avoid them. Um would I be able to hold an action if I do that? I, I can't remember how that works. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you're just driving. Yeah. Then Blood goes holding an action, probably for the for the final turn to drive away with enough people in the car. All right. This is the final opportunity, guys. Well, we're not driving away. Oh, I'm sure some of some of us aren't. <laughs> big, big, big goes like, wait for Get me. Get out of this car. And then, uh, so that's what Blood goes doing. Vinny. Vinny's gonna, he'll shoot three shots at Talos. Hey. And then attempt to get back in the vehicle if that's how it's gonna work. Yeah. Oh, by the way, Baps. Yes, uh, I will say after this hit, you do have a, a, a scar that runs across your body that is in the shape of lightning. Like, you know, when people get hit by bolts of lightning. Yeah. It's yeah. that sort of scarring. You know what they say? It's a big guy and there's a big payout. No, fucking start blasting! <laughs> start blasting. 27, 20, uh, and 11. Okay. 27 will hit. So 11. As he boom, gets hit. And, uh,. Yeah, but he's gonna skedaddle into the vehicle. Actually, he's gonna go into this other seat and properly buckle up, if possible. All right, buckle in. That's us. All right. Uh, next is Ahmed. Um, All right. Did so, so, Master? Did you see that man almost die? <clears throat> I think I he died did. and came back. He actually did die and come back. He looks totally fine to me. So, um, you know, you might not have seen it, but Ahmed posted in the chat his uh, held spell got triggered when oh, yes. Talos swung. And, yes. And uh, Ahmed casts a spell 
and uh, you know Jeeves is mind linked with him, and so our med. All right, so they both cast. Well, well, sort of. Our med casts feeble mind. Oh. And attempts to blast Thalos's brain. Thalos's brain. He must make an intelligence his save. Intellect and personality, and at the same time. Our met our Jeeves wants to inflict disadvantage on him with silvery barbs. Okay, well that, give... that would just make him re-roll. So you wouldn't have to do it unless he fails. Oh or okay, unless he succeeds. Okay. Alright, so let's see. Alright. Does he succeed? An 18. No. Does he pass or save then? He fails. Oh yeah. Alright. As that thing starts to mess with his mind. Talos jerks backwards, he closes his eyes, and then he lets out a sigh. And he's gonna turn to you, Armed. No, dude. Uh oh. Oh. <laughs> hey, he only had four more of those. That is a lot of divine resistance. Oh, oh no. no. Well, he is yeah. a god. I will yeah. point this out. Yep. I, I would also like to point out we shouldn't be fighting this guy. I've been trying not to say it <laughs> since we're all in it. <laughs> um, he's pretty mad at our med. Oh, oh. oh god. Boom. Oh. Actually, no. He's going to be here. Does that provoke opportunity from uh, Horus? It, it will provoke. And all right. my held action as well. Yes, it will do. It will do both. Excellent. All right, I'm swinging my I'm swinging my war hammer at this guy. Oh, we're gonna take this blue dot off him. Oh, oh boy! All right, so he's moving over here. Yes, uh, he, he's probably not gonna hit though, huh? Once he realized you were trying to fuck with his mind, he mm -hmm. is not happy and has this just look of grimace on him. He also has to do a dex saving throw against seventeen. Okay. Do dex. Here's the dex. 10, he fails it. Yeah, Ooh. 11 damage. All right. Uh, what type of damage is it, just so I know? Uh, fire, I think. It's most oh. minute meteors. I'll go read it again. All right, so one of them poof, shoots him, hits him. Yeah, uh, Horus, he, he, again, moves very fast with his big man um, and just whoop right over to where Armed is. Oh! Uh, uh, Jeeves puts his arm in front of Armed uh, to try and, like, take like defend no oh wait hold on oh shit okay hold on our meds you said for him to be smart right i did jeeves looks at talos dead in the eyes and goes think you can defeat me and my simulacrum nice try even for a god you are doomed to fail is that <laughs> wow right? what a swell guy <laughs> Is okay. Is it still uh, our turn? Yes, it is still your turn. Okay, Armed looks over at Jeeves and he goes. He's taken aback. He's like, "Wow, thank you, Jeeves. Thank you, Master. Thank you." Say master. He won't say Master. He won't say that. He's still far. You, he's you a little to too say, proud. He goes. Yeah, he goes. Wow, thank you. And then uh, he gives Jeeves a knowing look. And uh, they both uh, misty step into the rumbler. All right. Ooh. Into the rumbler. Into oh. the rumbler. Uh, oh, gosh. Yars calls out to, to Babs. And he goes, we getting out of here or what? <laughs> Babs coughs up some smoke. Actually, actually, <laughs> instead, <laughs> instead of what, instead of that, Babs or Yars actually asks, uh, "You getting back in there?" <laughs> is that Babs just coughs up some smoke? Uh, is is Babs prone, DM, uh, from getting killed? Yeah, you're probably prone because <laughs> you had to have been been killed which would have knocked you prone and then gotten back up 
Yeah, you just see a, him cough and a, a puff of smoke kind of just exits through the, the breathing slits of his helmet. It's smoke and a little bit of dust. Uh, if you remember, Baps is cursed, I believe. Uh, once he dies, he, he turns to dust, so. Ooh. Like, that could have been just straight up it. Yeah. Yars looks over at Ansel, and he goes, Ansel. In the fucking car. Don't shoot at him, okay? <laughs> don't shoot at him. I don't yeah, plan to. Just fucking boots it. <laughs> Best you run, you little mole rat. <laughs> oh, man. Yars is pissed about that. Yeah. He calls Yars a mole rat. Mm-hmm. Um, and is that it for their turn? Uh... <sighs> Yeah, that's it. All right. Talos, uh, in the middle of turns, is going to lift his hammer up, and it begins to just spark with lightning. Oh, uh, God. On his the start of his next turn, in a 60-foot radius, people will have to make deck saves. Now, people in the Rumbler are going to be safe because it kind of works like a Faraday cage. Hmm. to see there you all see that oh yeah um as the air begins to crack with lightning oh man as a bonus action i'm gonna heal 2d6 which is gonna give me plus seven that in okay um and holding ragnar's head like like his hair, I'm just gonna start lifting him up, and I'm gonna expend the level one spell slot. As I, it it'll crit because um because oh yeah, Ragnar, Rachel, yeah. What do you do? Ragnar's unconscious. Yeah. Um, I'm I I'm doing inflict wounds at level one just to see, and it'll be sixty six of necrotic. Yeah, you you fry him. Yeah, but I want to see if it actually like does anything to the dragon. Nope. That that's that's the whole that's the whole thing of what I was doing. So the dragon is is still very pissed uh, in the background, but uh, other than that, is not uh, does not seem like directly affected. Okay, I, I guess I'll do it thematically in the sense where I'm just like burning my hands like on his neck, so this way like maybe there's something behind. I don't know. Um, All right. I feel like I feel like that's thematic. I mm -hmm. there's a part of me that really wants to drag him with us, and like chain him to like the bottom of the boat and just leave him under the water. Uh, well, you so gotta as, make that decision. As as Yars is gonna see that Droga is dragging Ragnar into this thing. What the hell are you doing? An eye for an eye. As like, you, like you see that like Drog is not entirely thinking straight. Leave that piece of shit out of here. We've killed him twice. All right, I'll uh, I'll get in the rumbler, but I'll purposely place Ragnar like in front of the wheel, so this way he'll get run over. <laughs> okay. As I'll get in. Fucking failure. Looking at Ragnar when he says that. Uh, Bats. Oh, you man. What's up? DM? You <laughs> are alive. <laughs> Bats gets up and, and, and shoots to his feet. Um... DM, is his, is his armor, like, totally broken? Uh, yes. It is, is hanging off you in shambles. Uh, the rune's now dull and, uh, and flat. He the looks around. The armor is destroyed. But we, 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 we gotta cheese it for, for now. Oh, he he doesn't doesn't like this. Uh, but he he has to he has to dash. All right, 
It did, jumping it did in. The, yeah, jumping in. Oof. Uh. But he will he will hang, kind of uh, by the the open door to try and grab anybody who's who's trying to jump in. I will say Talos is is giving kind of a bemused look uh, to you. Uh, Zinn is jump... going. Oh, yeah. go ahead. I was gonna say as we jump to Zinn and, and our Ansel. Okay, Zinn is gonna go straight for the car. Uh, just dash it out right to the back seat. <laughs> Runs the Ansel. back seat. Ansel's also going to dash. Hey, yeah, you might want to be and, careful in that seat. Yeah. The seatbelt doesn't really work. Uh, just don't hit anything again, Yoko. Or is that Vinny talking to me? Yeah, that was Vinny. <laughs> that was Vinny. <laughs> okay. You all sound the same. It's weird. <laughs> um, is that it? Yeah, as they load up. Yeah, that, that's it. All right, bingo. Um, I will say you guys do notice this circle, right? Because there is like wind picking up and, and little sparks of lightning. Bingo. Uh, Bingo is going to, after seeing that display, uh, he is going to shit himself. No save. <laughs> okay. You play <laughs> auto fail. <laughs> auto fail. He's, he's just going to shit himself. But he is going to become invisible, uh, and he's going to run 25 feet, and then he's going to use his bonus action to dash, and he is going to stay outside of this circle and hope that he can, like, catch up to his friends. Yeah, you get he's just running into the, the feeling... storm. Yeah, Bingo which is... gets the feeling that, like, it's down here, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They... Bingo, can't you double dash? Uh, well, I used my action to shit my pants. To turn invisible. So, he's hoping if Talos does see him, it's not going to be nearly as bad. Yeah, well, he could probably smell me, but I am invisible. Yeah. Uh, and then Horus is going to, uh, is going to dash uh, and get in the car. He Let's heard see. that leaping towards the lightning stops it. Yeah, well, actually, um, he's actually, he can't quite get there, but he's going, he is not trying to get left. So he is going to just pop a, a misty step as his bonus action to get in the car. All right, as you move into the car. And suddenly we all, oh, it's Horace, not, uh, not Bingo. No, Bingo is yeah. not in the car. <laughs> now, I will say there is one flaw to Bingo's plan. Nobody can see him. <laughs> Nobody can see him. <laughs> Bingo's gonna get hit by the car, isn't he? Is that what's gonna happen? I hope so. <laughs> um, all right, uh, El Chan, your party members have all loaded him in a car, and you saw Bingo shit himself and run away. No shit, you saw Bingo shit himself. You did not see him run away. Invisible. Okay, and the car is going to the is which way is the car leaving? Uh, the car looks like it's gonna leave this this path down here. Okay. All At right. least I'm assuming he, he could whip it around it's... and technically head it the other way. Yeah, I was thinking the fire heading, is the, heading southeast. The fire so like, is like because yeah. kind of safe over there. Yeah. <laughs> unless I ha unless I don't like. Do I think the rumbler can make it over that log, or is that log there anymore? Yeah. I can't remember you, if I got used to it. But... Oh no, this this log is gone. No okay, way. so this yeah. log isn't actually there. Yeah, then Blog is silly thing of going just straight southeast around Talos and not trying to like having to like run him over or back up and then go forward again. Okay. <laughs> All right. El Chat has two options: survive in the wintry cold, or try to rescue Bingo. Invisible Bingo. Do you have footsteps? Now, I'm gonna. I'm oh gonna yeah, roll. there is footsteps in the snow. I'm roll yeah. two decks. and the smell. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I needed survival with advantage. Oh, no, that's it. Well, that works. You okay. see, you look down, and he, Bingo's like, "Fuck, he'll never see me." At least, and you see like little droplets of turd 
like along the, the path. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna run over, uh, scoop him up, and use the dash action to drag him another. 15 now, when you up. scoop him up, is it more like like a cat? You grab him by his collar and basically lift him. <laughs> no, <I'm> gonna... <laughs> yes. Or are you gonna hold shit covered bingo in your arms like a baby? Gra- I'm gonna grab his arm and drag him. Okay. Okay, so I'm behind. Yeah. yeah. All right. Is that it? Yep. I think seeing that okay. uh, that everybody's in the car who's going to be in the car, that might trigger <laughs> Bloco's reaction to just punch to punch and get the hell well, out. I don't think Yars is in the car yet, right? Where Where is he positioned? Uh, Yars, oh, he is. Yars should have been. Or is he like on the car? Oh, did you make it? Yeah. Okay, here, I'm going to put you there so we know you're in the car. Oh, okay. All right. So, I guess what's going to happen is everybody is going to fucking punch it and boom, this way. Uh, as this happens, boom, this massive flash of white appears um, and just rips everything in this radius apart. Luckily, the rumbler is uh, insulated in a way that electricity will not enter the cab uh the the lights on the dash sort of spark and 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 flash um a bunch of warning signs suddenly appear these red markings that just say warning 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 like hostile environment um and then uh there's just this loud explosion as lightning cracks down um and then talos sees you all leaving? I need to make a check. See if he's angry. <laughs> no, I know exactly what he's gonna do. Never mind. How much damage do we do to Ragnar by running him over? Uh, you just... <laughs> it doesn't matter at this point. He's down. Talos is gonna walk over to Ragnar. And look down at him. You may be a fucking failure, but you got your uses. And I say when we're done. And he looks his hammer down and touches Ragnar with it. A crack of lightning pulses through Ragnar's body. As he is brought back up uh, to a hit point. Oh man! Let's go. <laughs> Make yourself fucking useful. Go get them. I got other shit I gotta get to. Um, <laughs> oh, and then shit. he is going to leap uh, this way, basically heading back into the storm as uh, Ragnar is now up and running. Uh, st- stunned for one round or one turn? Uh, it is one one round. Okay, just making sure. So uh, it is, once it gets to his turn, he's, at the end of his turn, he will no longer be stunned, basically. Um... I think there's probably enough time for Bingo and, and El Chad to hop in the car. Yeah, we're going to run over there. All right. Just yeah. barely. We'll go and see uh, oh. El Chad and stop. You all hop uh, in the car. Oh, does Bingo as you, say As I get in the car, I, I imagine you guys can't see me, but you can smell me. You can smell him. Who oh boy. He stinks. Stinky. Uh-oh, stinky. How's it? Uh, I made a stinky. All right, fellas, let me rearrange this map a little bit. Oh, my goodness gracious. Can you possibly Ow. drag the tokens from the last map onto this one? Uh, Yes, I can. Give me one moment. Oh, okay. can you do that? I, I, don't actually, know. I didn't think you could do that. I, I think I can. Let me, let me attempt it, and then we'll go from there. How about that? Oh, maybe with the new the new way that they um, 
This is new tech. Like, yeah, they this they is... set up the uh, the folders and stuff and the different things. This is new tech I'm pulling out. Oop. No, I didn't copy it. That was probably the main reason why that didn't work, huh? Wait, why not? Oh, I'm on the GM layer. That's why I didn't copy none of it. We go to this map again and hey everybody we made it hey, 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 hey. can you move them is are they movable or oh they're yeah, movable it... oh hell yeah heck yeah um i do have a picture of the inside of the rumbler should it matter oh yeah yeah it's up we're the probably top actually in the in the rumble or not it's okay you guys can put yourselves either place uh baps is which actually would be, which would be better to, for y'all like baps is actually gonna climb on top of the rumbler all right then we'll all get in the rumbler all right we are gonna do a d4 all right you guys have three i'm rounds. getting in the rumbler yes evil can evil can get on the rumbler i am on this rumbler um so who is on top of the rumbler, I guess? It's Baps. Just Baps, Bloco's, I think. Bloco's not in it. Uh, Vinny's not on top of it, right? Or is Vinny no. on top? Of it? No, he's not. Go. I was trying to, I was trying to have two tokens, okay. one in place. Is Droga on top? I... The yes. only reason I'm, I'm, I'm saying, like, I need to know is because it actually is kind of important, right? So, hold on. I have... Move this to back. Where's that fucking thing? Move to back. Yes, because I need to grab this and delete it. Okay, here we go. Um, the only reason I need to know. You guys have basically three rounds, so we'll roll initiative. Uh, you have three rounds to prep up. Something's going to happen in three rounds. Oh, no. Are we doing the uh, both our characters roll go on the same? Yes, we're we're gonna do that again because that seemed to work out pretty good. Yeah, like speed things along, you know. All right, so you can take Bingo off the turn order then. All right. Ooh. Ending. There's so much I have to like fuck with. Uh, I need to go here. Everybody got their their stuff planned out for today. <laughs> uh -huh. Oh yeah. I'm sorry. I'm I'm doing a, a little bit of prepping in the background here. That's I, fine. I, I didn't expect some things, and I expected other things, you know? Uh, as the Rumbler's driving away with, with Droga and Baps on the back, uh, Baps, again, armor just kind of flapping loosely. His gut kind of spilling out over it, pale flesh with the, the very new lightning burn down the front of it. Uh kind of grasps Droga with that you, you know that 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 manly warrior handshake yeah good good good, good to have you back uh, I didn't I didn't think we'd make make it <laughs> me, me, me neither but uh, we, 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 now now we just got to make sure we get 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 to the boat and then we can tell our girls we punched a god in the face. As, as like Droke is like like holding like holding on and like just trying to laugh through the pain. All right, we got three rounds of prep time. Loco, is there anything you want to do, or is there anything you can do? I guess. Uh, well, Bloco's basically driving. Um. 
and I guess he'll he'll think about it while driving this turn <laughs> since we have three turns. All right, Zin. Oh wait, 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 Vinny. Oh yes, Vinny. Oh, Vinny, Vinny. Vinny does have stuff. Uh, he's gonna put one of the five d six potions into the wolf pelt satchel belt again, so he can bonus action that. Uh, I'm assuming that takes just like an to action. Make it, I think just to make it faster, you get three actions, right? We'll you get just, three it's actions. Assuming three, yeah, we'll just assume three rounds are happening. All right, then can we come back to Blowgun at the end so I can have a little bit more time with that? Uh, yeah, Vinny's yeah, yeah. just Vinny's gonna he's gonna put the he's gonna pack the wolf belt satchel. He's gonna ask if anybody wants to use a runestone of returning. It, it's gonna make your weapon come back to your hand after you throw it. Um, and he's just pulling shit out of his pocket. He's he's, he's gonna to... he's gonna he's gonna ask Tim Juan if he's got a hey, hey boss. Uh, 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 yeah. You know I think we did good back there, but uh, any 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 advice? For the current situation. Uh, current as in, uh, we just need to get away? Yeah. Yeah, no, keep fucking driving. Full blast there, uh, you man. Bloco. Yeah. That's what I thought, all right. Yeah, Bloco, keep it up. Come on, left foot it. Yeah, all right. Uh, there you go. All right. Horace. Uh, I mean, horse I, is just. I, I didn't gonna... go. Oh, sorry. Oh, oh, go ahead. I'm sorry. You go first. Yeah. Um, are we still within 120 feet of uh, Ragnar? Uh, no. You guys do not see him after you tore off. Okay. Um, then Zen's just chilling. Yeah, because basically, That's like, it. imagine there's this big snowstorm going on. Yeah. All right. Uh, now horse. Uh, horse is, horse is probably just chilling. Um, Bingo is going to try and clean his pants up a little bit, so he's actually going to take his uh, pants off. His, he's got those silk padded pants, uh, and as as he takes them off, and they're no longer on him, you guys do see his pants, but not him, and he sort of is laying them on the ground. <laughs> He's sort of laying them on the shit pants on the ground. <laughs> yeah, and he's sort of trying to scrub them and rub them out with the. Uh, you like, like roll down a window and with like the, yeah with his sock. He's got a sock that he's trying to use to like clean it out with and right, throw it I out the window. A, I need a strength check uh, as you put <laughs> oh, it out the window. Oh no, it's gonna come back in my face. <laughs> <laughs> Nine. As you do, it, well, a nine's not so bad. It's not a one. That's what I would have yeah. said a one was. Unfortunately, this is, and it just slips out of your hand, and your underpants just gone. Oh, shit. Well, yeah, landmine. Starting to smell better in here now, though. Yeah, basically. Oh, I mean, I guess that's. You know, it, is, it is what it is. I'll, I'll also toss the the shitty sock out the window as well, and I'll just put um, my pants back on, commando style, and uh, we'll carry on. All right. Uh, next is El Chad. Is there anything right. Chad would want to do? Um, El Chad's going to chug a health potion. Okay. Uh, I remember you have three actions on each of your turns. I, I don't know if that was clear. Yeah, I I know. All right, that's, that's a shitty health potion. No, no, it's max, isn't it? Because you're still oh, yeah, concentrated yeah, yeah. on it, that. It thing. is max, so that's the. Well, it eight. is after a minute. It probably hasn't been a full minute yet. Oh, nice. Now, how many minutes are three actions? Because there's a spell that I'm thinking about casting that takes 10 minutes. And it's 18 seconds. Yeah. Three. Okay, so, so we're, yeah, just doing 18, eight. we're just yeah. doing 18 seconds. Yeah. Okay. Um, no, nothing else. El Chad wants right. to do. Actually, he's gonna he's gonna get prepped to lean out the window. All right, lean out the window, window and ready. Droga. All right, I'm going to use my Aura of Vitality three times, which is 66, 
And then I'm going to use uh, my fourth level spell slot to cast Cure Wounds up to level four. And then I'm going to use um, a Channel Divinity to get a third level spell slot back. And then I'm going to use uh, that third level spell slot to cast Cure Wounds at third level. So 78 on top of this. Nice. I'm actually going to take this car and I'm going to move it. And then that's actually plus uh, seven to that. So that's going to be... I got it. I got a calculator. All right. That ends me. Ooh, a lot. Fancy McDancy have a calculator, eh? Uh, next is uh, Baps. All right. Uh, Baps is out of second wind and has no health potions of any type. And so first thing he's going to do with his first action is he's going to use whatever buckles and everything are, are kind of left of his shredded dwarven armor to kind of just at least cinch him down and tie him around himself so that okay. they're not flapping around. Roll, uh, roll 2d6 for me. All right. Great. All right. As you start to kind of put this this armor together as best you can, um, there really isn't much left of it. Um, but what there is is the equivalent of a chain shirt, um, which is a uh, thirteen AC plus Dex uh, max of two. Okay. Uh, thirteen. That's two is what I've got. So. Babs has a 16 AC as opposed to a 13. That's so that. It's better. Yeah. Now you feel um, like the plate is really what took the the brunt of that hit. Yeah. All right. Um. Then he's gonna kind of just kneel down on the the top of this rushing vehicle, and he's gonna put his mind to the ring of tracking. All right. The ring of tracking forward. Does he feel uh does he feel Daw's presence? You do. Uh her presence is is starting to get lower, so the rock must be descending. Okay. Uh he'll You can assume really... towards the ship. Yeah. There's no way for Baps to really yell back to, to Bloco. Yeah, there's like a, a hatch to the inside. <clears throat> we'll say this is the hatch. Yeah. Bloco or he'll he'll go down and he'll he'll point in the direction of the feeling. <coughs> Bloco! Yeah. The, we're going go go uh, uh pro approximately th th that direction. All right. Pointing kind of like through the storm. And then I guess with his third action, he's going to pull out his last bit of cave cheese I and open his helmet, it. take a little bit of a munch on it, and <laughs> offer half of it to Droga. The uh, 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 last meal? Last meal. That if cheese you... definitely smells foul. If uh, if I don't make it out of this as you do, tell uh, you should take Noth to the Enclave. Uh, uh, Enclave? Yeah, where Sigtir and I are from. All right. Well, sure. Won't matter too much though. We'll, we'll... We're going to get through this y yet. And uh, Drogon's actually, he's going to, he's going to look at, a, at, at, down at his hair. And he, there's a, there's a piece of like blonde hair, like tied in with it. And he's going to take like his dagger and he's just going to like cut it off, like cut the dread off. And whatever's like, if there's like a bandolier or like any kind of strap, Drogon's going to just like tie it. And he's just be like. There. I'll be able to find you with that. At least when you're closer. Oh, 
Oh, oh, okay. Well, th 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 thank you. Well, let's let's get, get ready. And that's uh that that'll be Baps. All right, our med and Yars. <clears throat> Yars is shaking his head. He's like, I wanted to fight again. <laughs> no, no, no. Now you listen here, dwarf. <laughs> We were, my master was in quite, quite a lot of danger back there. Yeah, we could have taken them. I, I think that that I is most know. illogical to think that we could. <sighs> Yars, Yars doesn't appreciate Jeeves because he's not a melee. He doesn't wield a weapon and he just sort of looks away. <laughs> you know, you could come up here, short stack. Are you talking to Yars? Yes, from on top the roof. All right, Yars is gonna be like, ah, I've had it with you people, and he he comes onto the roof, <laughs> climbing through the the hatch here. Yeah, he <laughs> climbs through the hatch. He gets onto the roof. Baps and, offers uh, him the cave cheese. No, oh. all right, yeah, I'll have some. yeah for sure. I'll have some. Does Yars have any fun? Uh, you probably got ale, some oh, ale. Oh, I certainly do. I have a a, a flask of never ending, never ending whiskey. <laughs> I forget what it is. Yeah. Um. Let's see. What else does Yars do? I think Yars is gonna prep a little bit, and he's going He's going to. He's collected a bunch of poisons over his career. He's going to put a little poison. He's got a, a vial of orchid poison from when we fought the Oleander Dragon and the big uh, monster orchid. Ooh, that was a while ago. Yeah. yeah. I, have a, I have a million things in here from a while ago. Uh, <laughs> and he puts it on the, uh, he, yeah, he poisons it up. And he goes, oh, almost forgot I had this. And he whips out his potent pipeweed. And uh, I he still has his hookah, so he's going to, you know, <laughs> light it up and like, <laughs> pass it around to Droga and, and Babs. Ooh. And we're going to have some Ooh. exceptional visions. Yeah. And uh, we're each going to gain 5 XP. 5 <laughs> XP? That's 5 XP. Yeah. That's what it does. XP. <laughs> what, if I, what if I told you this 5 XP? What Pay if I told you what if I told you this 5 XP got me to level 16? Pay to win. And, uh, well, pay to win. <laughs> pay to win. And so we're just all going to have a good time up here. And let's see. I think what's going to happen is uh, our med, this is this is a little uh, self-serving, but our med's like, um, um, Yars, before you go, uh, he gives a bardic inspiration to him. <laughs> and then uh, Jeeves, being the smart guy that he is, Pops his head up out the hatch and gives Babs a bardic inspiration. Ooh. You took that blow like a champ. Yeah. Th 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 thanks. As like a little bit of blood is going down Babs' mouth. Like from the <laughs> I like that he coughed and smoke came out. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's my turn for prep. Hey, that dwarf bothers me. Uh, yep. Yeah, he's a he's a strange one, you know, a, a real go getter. I don't care much for those types. Yes. As uh, as you guys are sort of railing onward. Um, oh, can I try to do action since I had oh, thought yes, of me for Bloco? Yes, Bloco's, Bloco's action. Um, is it possible? To have someone hold the wheel while I uh, cast Scroll of Sinsu Bean. Yazdi, yeah, take the that. wheel. Yazdi, take Yossi. the wheel. <laughs> yeah. You're like it's driving invisible. with your knees. What are you talking about? You're good. So that's basically just good, Barry, which does that give you 10? I don't remember how that Yes, works. that would give you 10. All right, yeah. We're then... also just driving on a tundra, so it's like you could swerve a little bit. Yeah, just a little bit. No one would know. <laughs> <laughs> You're just gonna munch down some yeah no, no. Some, some uh, beans. Logo's gonna pass them out and explain uh, these are these are to help us get back up if we need it. 
And uh, other than that, He's just going to think about two of his items, uh, the mind reading medallion, and just, just thinking if, if that could ever be useful. And also, moon parchments. Uh, Brad, I hope you still have the rules for moon parchments. Because I sure Because I you never wrote that. it down. <laughs> you know I, I don't. I just know I have two of them <laughs> left, and the description says, less dangerous way to boost decks. <laughs> I've got it. Because I remember, I remember the, the straight seeds will kill you if you fail to save. Yeah. <laughs> but this won't kill you. It'll just it do something that's heart. bad. Yeah, it stops your oh, heart. It, it gave you, uh, it, it makes you hallucinate, though. It gives you, you oh, take that's the effects is. of um, hypnotic colors or something. Okay. <laughs> Don't do that while driving. <laughs> no, not while driving. <laughs> but desperate times call for desperate easy. measures. Heart will stop if you fail a constitution check. Those are for the seeds, <laughs> though. The 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 papers are are uh, are cut. Yeah, I don't. Well, I don't stop know their turn. boost or the save value, but we can look that up later because I don't think it's be necessary tonight. Yeah. Uh, but that's that's all Blanco did. As you guys are driving, Baps and Droga, mm -hmm. you guys are going to notice. The snow is slowing down. That's, uh, it's that, that's not a, a good warm. It's not 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 a great sign, I'm thinking. But the worst is yet to come. As in the distance, that storm slows down just a bit, enough for a glowing red light to appear. <laughs> as a roar comes barreling out from that storm straight towards the car. Shit. Um, swooping down uh, low enough to be seen is the dragon. <laughs> uh, its eyes burning with this sort of uh, uh, puree. Uh, they're squinted a bit. It looks injured. You see, like, magma dripping from it. Um, as it swoops down, you see a figure leap off of its head. And it's boom! Ragnar. Slam on top of the Rumbler's hatch. Let's oh, go. No. Boom! Well, didn't think I'd let you leave the party this early, did you? Mm. Now, where were we? And I'm going to roll his initiative. <laughs> oh, of course, he's on top. That, that thematically <laughs> makes the most sense. Uh. Alright, let's actually, we should fix our tokens because uh, we're kind of overlapping each other. Uh, here, I'll pick them there. Yeah, got some rolls to do. Good to see you, old boy. Glad you're I feeling do... better. What? Oh, uh, El Chad. What do you think I was leaning out the window with? My lance. A lance. I will say a lance actually makes the most sense. That's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Now, oh, and you're gonna hit him for sure. Now hold on. Now hold on. What are we on? A metal like car? Or what a do you mean? A horseless carriage. No oh! combat. This is a mountain. I'll give you it. This is... <laughs> it was a horseless carriage. Well he would technically oh, yeah. be mounted too, isn't he? Nah. He yet. has he has the high ground. He does have the high ground. I will give it to you because of the surprise of it. Right? <laughs> I want you to turn this car around and lance this dragon also. That would be fun. <laughs> <laughs> like some kind of dragon lance. Yeah. yeah. As you hit him, El Chad. I uh, Can't you see I'm trying to have a conversation? 
Yeah, hold on for a moment. Uh, it's, it's a pokey. It's a pokey vehicle. And he is going to, uh, I think he's going to punch Yara's first. <laughs> okay. Let's see if he hits him. Uh, what do you do? Where is it? Damn it. There it is. Slugging blow. Ooh. Does 28 hit? It does. But Yars is going to use his reaction to boom block that hit. Oh yeah, can it count it as a reaction to add plus four to your AC? Um, if the melee would hit, if it misses you, uh, did okay. So it does miss you. So I can attempt to shove him back ten yes. feet. Yes. So that's what I will do uh, with my. Athletics. Let's see it. He gets his. Um, now he does have advantage on these because he is uh, currently raging. Oh, damn it! So he boom hits your shield. Ooh, looks like you got some new gear. Got it from your dragon. <laughs> well, let's see how you put it to good use. Uh, and he's gonna. Whack you with another hit. Oh, man. Oh. Hits. All right. So that's uh, 20 damage from that hit. Okay. Um, And then I think he's going to make you make a dex save. Okay. Ooh. Let's see what we got here. Nice. Yeah. Boom. He tries to hit the shield out of your hands. And how does Yaris hold on to it? Does he kind of like pull it towards him? Yeah. Yeah, he just he flexes real hard behind it and pulls it towards him. All right, get off of that! Wham, ding! You you pull it towards you. He swings with one more hit. It Ooh, does he's hit. getting high rolls. Uh, this is a a pretty nasty hit. Okay, um, that is what what thirty thirty four. All right. So he just wham, wham, wham. Ooh. I have the most fun fighting you. Oh, no offense, Stroger. In fact, the two I like fighting the most are here. Yay. Um, <laughs> a as a reminder, uh, he does have... Uh, so he is going to step over here. Um, and he's going to lean out uh, over the side for a moment, and he's going to swing at El Chad. No, actually, no, he's not going to swing at El Chad. I know what he's doing. El Chad, he reaches down to grab you. Now, come on. Oh. Uh, uh, I need an be acrobatics or athletics. Yeah, I was about to say that we tested. Um... Oh, oh, damn. Just barely. As you, you're like, shit. El Chad, you get yanked out of the the car and plopped behind him. There you go. Now you can be part of this. Um, okay. And I think it's at this point he is going to swing his other two heads. Loop, loop. Lovely. Oh, that's a crit on the first one. So that is... 28 damage at me or Trojo? at you oh it's 28 on the first one and then yes. the second one hits for another 12 uh no he swings that second one at droga he's he's I... spreading the wealth but i do need you to make a deck save this time or actually no never mind make a strength save strength saving throw Oof. Hell yeah. You pass it and boom! You kind of get staggered off your feet. You feel like he was trying to punch you off the front of the car. Uh, Droga, 21 hit you. Yeah. All right, you're going to take uh, 30 damage. Half. I'm going to take half of that because I'm a barbarian and he's raging. Oh, he has an order yes, of rage. That, that is important. Where is it? Do, 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 do. I had it. All right, so that's 
six, so I still minus twenty-four. Um, Fafnir is roaring and flying down, um, basically swooping along the ground um, during this fight. So stuff will happen at the basically top of the order. Um, but top of the order this time was it flew down to the position it's in now. <laughs> All right, Bloco. Uh, Bloco has an epiphany and immediately goes, oh my God, we forgot Muse. <laughs> no, Muse had spider climb, remember? Muse was just stuck like a magnet. Oh. You actually look, you look Bloka behind you, and Muse has somehow in the chaos like slid from the ground underneath one of the seats <laughs> and it's like wedged. <laughs> um, is, is the dragon, uh, was that like, like, 30, 40 feet from us, or how close is it to the Rumbler? The dragon is, is just as close as he is, so that's 40 feet, 40, 50 feet. 40, 50 feet back, and how high up, or like on the ground? Basically above the ground, Basically right? above the ground, okay. He, he's, he's so big that technically he's like 40 feet up, but also like down on the ground, you know what I mean? Just imagine it's a big ball, big ball of death. All right, well, Bloco's doing two things, uh, continuing to drive away from the big ball of death and yes. keeping an eye out for maybe some way to do some kind of jumping lance thing with the vehicle if that comes up again, but mostly All just right. evading. And uh, you, you can yep. just do that as basically your movement. You're basically just spending your movement to do it. Um, uh, you can also, as an action, swerve up or down, basically. So oh, this like way dodge. or this way. Yep. Now, why that will be important? Because it, it's going to come up eventually. Well, Logan's trying to evade, so he'll he'll swerve up, I guess. Swerve the whole car up? Yes. Or do you want to just keep it straight for the moment? Just go ahead and swerve the whole car up. You know, the dragon's pretty close. It, it's not super comfy being li in, li in a straight line with it. All right. Boom. Uh, and then what is Vinny doing? Uh, I will say that um, there are basically people up on the hatch now, so there, it's not easy to get to the roof. Um, but you can get out from the doors, basically, on either side. Vinny is going to uh yeah he'll he'll just uh lean out the window take a peek at Ragnar and Cast magic missile and remember to roll for chaos this time. All right, let's see. It. Let's see, here's the chaos roll. Um, the chaos makes the car stop. The the count resets every session, or is it in game day or something like that? I'm trying to remember how that works. No, no, it's still the same session. So, well, I mean, like, does that mean it's reset to one, or is it still at three? It's still at three. All right, here we go. Yes. Something crazy oh. happens, but uh, all right. let me go ahead and roll the magic missile damage. Yes. Right, Three. So ten. I still have it. Here it is. Sorry, it was taking me a second to find my table again. <laughs> I see. So he might take three. full force damage. All right, that. <laughs> hitting him. He he he's pretty hurt by that. I mean, those little pellets hurt after a while. Uh, now I need you to roll. Oh God, which so, table? So one hundred. Should I do? Okay, let me tell you this. Let me put put it this way. Should I use the the small table or the big fucking table? 
Are they both homebrew? Um, are they? Um, are they? Are either of them legitimate uh, Wizards of the Coast products? They're not. Neither of them are Wizards of the Coast product. All right, then I'm fine either way. Big table. Big, big table, table. Big table. Big table. Big table. Big, big table, prize table. or big punishment. <laughs> oh, I'm looking God. for double it's... hundreds here. Yeah, just like the ballista damage. <laughs> Ballista damage. That's I right. wish we had one of those right now. Uh, Vinny turns into a rocket. <laughs> okay, hold on. I, I gotta figure out what you gotta roll. Okay. I need you to roll. Roll. A D. One. Now type this in. Oh, God. What? I need you to type in slash roll. Yeah. Space. 1D. 10,000. Ah, that is Whoa. a big deal. That is a huge saver. Yes. What's 69, 69? Oh, that's high. 9765. 9765. Nine, Hold, let me scroll down. <laughs> I don't know, guys. It's not even in the top 2,000. 97. Uh -huh. What six, was it? 9765. Wait, is it actually a 10,000? It is. It's actually. Table? It is actually a 10,000. That's some pretty wild magic. I wonder if some of those That's things take fun. up like different size ranges or something. Okay. Um. How do oh I do boy. This? It says somebody nearby, so I need to figure out who that somebody. <laughs> Probably is. someone who's in the vehicle. Why don't we give everybody a number and roll? For, like. Okay. Okay. Everybody. That's one, a good two, idea. Three, four, five, seven. Six, seven, eight. Eight. So I got eight. Eight people in the vehicle. So it said somebody. Is it? Do I count as somebody nearby myself, or would I be excluded and that be seven? Okay, we'll say it's seven. It's not you. And then what about the hatch? Because if somebody's standing on it, that's still within proximity. No, because they're, they're outside, aren't they? Okay. But that, it could be anybody. It could be. Okay, hold on. I'll, I'll assign numbers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 13. So there's 13, oh no, there's 12 people not counting Vinny. Perfect. Um, I need you to roll a d12. Right. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh god, it's El Chad. Oh god. <laughs> um, it's a good right, thing though, right? Roll a d100. Roll a d100. I hope this isn't damage. <laughs> Oh, my uh, God. El Chad. Yes. You are on there. Magic missile bolt hit Ragnar. But then the sparks of magical energy sort of fly off of him and hit you. And when this happens, you are going to shrink. Um, Very, very small. <laughs> Tiny El Chad. <laughs> Hold on, I gotta figure out how many this is in feet. Hold on. You are three three feet seventy-five inches. Wait, what? Wait, three 7. feet 5? seventy-five. Oh, three three point seventy-five. Oh, Basically. so that's a decimal. You're doing yeah, you're, as three, tall as, is, you're as tall as you're as tall as ours is now. <laughs> I'm three foot nine. You're three, three foot nine. Okay, perfect. You're as tall as Yars is. <laughs> Proportionately as tall, mind you. So you're like kind of bingo-ish. Yeah, because you're not as husky as as yeah. uh, Yars, I would imagine. Um, and you're you a get this feeling that it came from, uh, from Vinny. Yeah, yeah, like yeah but with, with like peace and love. Sorry, what? Bring yeah. me back. Y'all see what I can do. Sorry what? about that. One yeah, one advantage, wizard. though, is Ragnar doesn't seem to take you seriously. He actually kind of laughs at you for a minute. <laughs> uh, before drawing his attention back to Yars and uh, Droga. Lovely. Uh, and is that it for Vinny? Yep, yeah, that's it for my guys. All right, Zinn. 
Oh, jeez. So, we're not lined up with the dragon anymore, but is he at such an angle that I could hit yeah. him with a lightning bolt or something? Yeah, th this map is, is pretty much identical to where he is, right? Okay. So he's only 45 feet away from you. Oh, fuck. Okay, he's very close. Um, is, is there a way to open the window? Or yeah, just... th these these are open, because El Chad had to lean out of it to attack. Oh, I meant, I meant the back, if, if there's a back window. Oh, uh, yeah, there's the trunk. You can open the trunk. Um... Nah. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna go up to a, the window on this side of the car here. Okay. Um... Yeah, that's the right one. And then let's see how far away I am from him then. Am I on... Does he still have... Any eyes? Does he have an eye anymore? Um, his eyes are are still there, but they are um, they're basically squinting a little, and you see little bits of magma dripping from them, as it okay. seems like it's recovered a little from it. Okay, aiming at the eye, I am going to shoot a lightning bolt. All right. Uh, where is he here? Yeah, lightning bolt. I actually, need oh. to get off near his sheet. Real quick. Crack, crack. 15. That's what he... Excellent. Yep. He takes 26 damage. Or I guess 6 right. damage is. Uh, um, oh, nice. It, it, yeah, it broke the, uh, the boom. barrier. Yep. And then... Max into its eye. Uh, it yes. squints a bit. Uh, it doesn't seem like it's fully down, but it is, it is hurting. Okay, Ansel will, I guess, be beside Zen on the same window, and... Five, I think, since I have Sharpshooter, I'm actually good for this. Um, just gotta check the range of my gun. Oh, 3090, yeah, I'm good for this. Um, go pick a shot with the Rattler. Alright. 24 hit. That's gonna hit. Sick. Um, 19, so no damage. Or I guess only 9, so no damage. But mm -hmm. I have... Uh, well, you're shooting his eye specifically, though, right? Yeah. Okay, then no, that does hit. Okay, excellent. So for 9, and then I'll extra attack, and hit him again. For 5. Alright. And I'll do a turn. So let me total up that real quick. It is. Okay, his eye is squinting more and more. Um, for the people on top, uh, you guys see Ragnar have a little bit of blood under his eye. Uh, Horus. All right. Uh, well, first I'm gonna I'm gonna do bingo because I think it's been it's only oh, been like six seconds, right, since he put yeah. his pants back on. So he is gonna he is gonna climb up through the hatch onto the roof. And... There there are people standing on the hatch. Oh, okay. Well, he's gonna he's gonna be knocking on the hatch, be like, "Hey, you guys smoking a hookah up there? Mine's broken." And uh, you feel Ragnar stomp down on the hatch, oh. sort of knocking you off of it. At which point I look out the window and see a giant dragon, yeah, uh, and uh, and Ansel shooting at it. So I will I will uh, also shoot. Oblige. At it. Yeah, you know. Uh, so shooting from sort of from here is seventy feet, so that shouldn't be a problem. Uh, I'll take a shot at this thing. Are you going to shoot at the eye, or are you shooting at it? Um. Let me make an intelligence check to see if I figured out what Ansel's doing over there. No, I'm just gonna shoot. Well, right. no, because I was up there. I saw, I saw Nod stabbing the eye and stuff, and I was standing yeah. on it. I know that it. I know its weaknesses, yeah. so I, I am shooting the eye. All right. Unfortunately, with the 19, as it shoots towards it, it just sort of burns up in its uh, sort of fiery aura. So irrelevant anyway. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Uh, uh, Horus. Horus is going to be like, what's going on out there? And, uh, you know, you not... see a tiny El Chad. A I shorter see a tiny... El Chad. 
a shorter El Chad. El Chad! And I'm going to try and climb out the window and right. sort of sc scramble at the top if I can. Acrobatics. Like, acrobatics to get up the top. Uh, or, or athletics, actually. It's either. Or athletics. Oh, let's see. Athletics is better. I'm going to do athletics. Please don't fall out the side. I fall out the side. As as you have El Chad, don't worry, I'll Whoa and slide to the back rail. Boom. I'm There's hanging like fire. On. Yeah, you're hanging on dragging. The dragon is is barreling down. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, can I is that was that my action? No, you can make another athletics as an action though to okay. attempt to climb. I am gonna try and haul myself up from the back here. All right. Oh, 22. Right, as you uh, manage to get up to kind of stable ground enough to stand up. The fear, the fear kicked off my adrenaline and I just like powered <laughs> up the side. Yeah. Uh, and I see this Ragnar guy's uh, back. It's like, I thought yeah. he was dead. And I'm a little worried because he kicked the shit out of me last time I tried to fight him. But I see that small El Chad is in trouble. I assume that this guy uh, sh somehow shrank El Chad. So I am yeah, with his run evil magic. With his evil <laughs> magics. So I'm going to run over here and I'm going to make two Warhammer attacks at him. Uh, I will say it was your action to. to oh, that's right. To uh, survive so, the, the climb. So maybe I'll, for now. Maybe, I'll back stay, for now. maybe I'll stay back here for now then. Yeah. And that'll be my turn. All right. El Chad. Tiny El Chad. Uh, is Ragnar wearing clothes? Uh, he is not. Well, yeah, actually, no, he is wearing clothes. He's just not wearing, like, armor. Okay. Um, since I'm small and since he's no longer paying attention to me, uh, I'm gonna try to use my flame whip. Yo, ooh, that's gonna hit him. To set his clothes on fire. All right. I think I get the idea. Uh, where is and then he's going to run away. All right. Uh, one of them is going to hit. Uh, the other one. I think it probably makes sense. All right. Unfortunately, you do not catch his uh, his clothes on fire. Singe him a bit. Uh, but if you want to roll the damage for the one whip. All right, then I'm gonna. I'm also gonna try to hop down to the floor below me. In, in oh, middies, I need an acrobatics or an athletic. All right. Oh yeah, as you grab the edge and kind of deftly slide in, bingo. There is a halfling that's just jumped in that looks that's dressed like El Chad. Oh. <laughs> I just for now it's just I think just oh he's taken aback by that. Yeah. Definitely that doesn't drunk. recognize him though. I'm wondering if she's gonna breathe fire while you're stuck to this thing. I think one of us will fare better than the other. <laughs> we could find out as, uh, let's see. I, is there anything spiky or pointy? On the yeah, top there's of like thing? spikes and stuff on here. Okay. I want to, um, I'm going to hit him as, uh, as as my first act uh, as my first attack um i am not going to divine strike but i'm going to storm strike but i don't i don't want him to go flying with the lightning damage okay it's that's only a ha a may so you don't have to do it. okay that's gonna hit okay as i do 21 half is and all right he has okay. to make it he has to make a uh a con save versus a dc 18. con save versus 
does not have advantage on that, so he does fail it. All right, he's gonna have to boom, crack him as this like crack of lightning goes through him. Um, and when it does, he he kind of like stumbles backwards. It seems like uh, this is a guy who's been hit by a guy who hits him with lightning quite often. Um, I... As you see, his hands are shaking after being hit by it. <laughs> you fuck. I'm done playing around. You don't get to threaten my family and live to tell the tale. As uh, um, I'm gonna I'm gonna grapple him with uh with tavern brawler as my bonus action. God, you sound like the old man. And he spits on you. As <laughs> as I got a twenty nine. Right. Um. Oh, on athletics, he has to make an athletics as well. Yeah. Ooh, he got a 29. Now, does he uh, get a... Does that count as getting disadvantage on attack rolls? No. No, unfortunately not. So you you guys are grappled on one another. Basically, like, intertwined fingers, right? Pushing on one another? Yeah. Um, Ooh! Sweet. I, I, I like I'm, this. I'm starting I, to enjoy this, Droga our little meetings uh as he's pushing on you uh i i'm not sure how i'm gonna do this but it is this technically the i'm starting to enjoy this um no wait no this doesn't happen it only happens if he loses uh, but he's pushing and the plates on the rumbler are like bending underneath y'all's weight as you guys like push against one another okay um I'm gonna I'm gonna finish off my, with an act with a with another grapple. The intention is to kind of like roll and kind of like grab him fully, kind of like putting him in like a like kind of like choking him out kind of deal. All right, we'll we'll see how it goes. All right, let's see how this goes. Ah, uh, twenty-two. Twenty-eight. All right. He when you go to do it again, he just thwack swacks your hands out of the way. Um. You're gonna have to do better than that. Good luck trying to fucking hit me first. Oh. As, yeah, at least he's had, he has disadvantage on attack rolls until the start of my next turn. Yes, uh, which is very very good. But I need a better, like, icon for that. Um, should be there. It is that's the one I was looking for? Uh, Baps. All right. Baps is definitely going to run up over here. He saw the contest of strength between him and, and uh, Droga, right? Yes. Th them, like, wrestling with one another. And uh, having done that before, he knows about the chasm. And it seemed like it was tearing the rumbler apart. Yes. Uh, even though technically the contest didn't happen, I'll say it at least gave you guys the hint. That if it does happen, it might at least tear a hole in the top of the rumbler. Yeah, Baps was definitely about to try and push this guy around. Uh -huh. So probably not a good idea, huh? Well, you can it's attempt to, you. to shove him. Yeah, I mean, that was... Yeah, Baps is definitely going to try to shove him down, was the thing, as he comes up with the... Uh, in an, a two-handed overhang swing with the haft tries right. to push down and sh uh, shove Ragnar prone. Um, that Bardic Inspiration, do I use that before or after the roll? Uh, I think it's during the roll. I'm definitely going to be using that D6 for this. It's a D10. It's a D10. I'm definitely going to be using that D10 for this. All right. Uh, which is good because I rolled really fucking badly. I rolled a fucking two. Oh. He critted. Uh, so when you swing that halberd down, he reaches up with both hands and grabs it. Ooh! Ooh! You t you're tough! But after all, you did survive Father's Blow. I must give you some uh, commendability. What's your name? Back, he baps Plinker, you bastard, and this is our ride. And Baps is going to redouble his efforts and try, try again. All to right. Push him down. Uh, I... 
I'm gonna roll this. Ooh, you have to beat a 16. I I I think I cannot uh, possibly lose. Actually, <laughs> don't say that. You might roll a one. <laughs> I okay. still rolled like shit, but I pushed now, him down. I need you to roll 2d6 because we're determined. Since he's not on the ground, I don't want to just do the contest thing because I okay. think it might not. Hey! Well, I mean, all right. You As you lift it up, you boom he grabs it he taunts you back and you kind of lift up actually picking him up from the air and boom slam him down again and when yeah, that happens go it smashes a hole in the top of the rumbler and he falls through it into oh. the rumbler all right uh, and is knocked prone babs is gonna <laughs> jump down I, I, on top of our med. Sorry, our med. <laughs> I imagine our med steps back. He, I'll give you that. I'll say our med. Yeah, he takes a little step. Oh, oh dear. Oh dear, master, please. I'm fine, Jeeves. Thank you. Thank you for you. Babs uh, is going to reach down and push Ragnar with a shove. Ow, 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 out you go, f -f fucker. All right, and he I believe at... he gets advantage on this, and uh, Duder gets disadvantage because he's prone. Yes, uh, but he he is raging, so he actually just gets a normal roll, basically. That's fine. Uh, and it is an athletic. God yeah. damn it, this guy and his crits. I guess he does have a... a... As you... How do you uh, try to knock him out? Well, he's down. Uh, Baps was just going, and he was going for just a big kick. When you go to kick him, he like whip, he like basically MMA like rolls onto his back and grabs Baps' leg um, with his hands and feet. Oh, I'm not leaving this dance yet. This is just getting s started, asshole. And I was about to say the same surge. thing. Ooh. Uh, hell yeah. Pop an action surge. We try it again. Ooh, boy. This is exciting. Oh, ooh, it's 16. All right. Um, an 18. 18 yes. How does, God, um, how, how like does Babs shit. do this, right? Like, as Ragnar is, like, wrapped on his leg at the moment. Uh, Babs still is upright, and he's wrapped on his leg. Uh, Babs reaches down with the haft of the halberd and puts it right at his core in his guts and twists it and basically just shoves it like a pool cue and shoves him back five feet yeah basically pries his him off of his leg like a uh like you're pulling a, a lobster shell off or something just poof, you hear like a crack of bone um okay 18. So he goes out of the car, begins sliding, and actually grabs onto the back wheel of it as he goes sliding off. All right, Babs is going to follow him. Babs is going to vote, and he's going to kind of grab onto the side. Uh, here, I'm going to his... put... If it's all right, I'm going to put you... Uh, you'd be like here, basically. Yeah. Uh, he's going to kind of use his boots of flight to, to stay above, holding onto the car. He's going to maneuver down. Yeah. I, I believe he has all of that movement pretty much. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. That might be all of his movement. Yeah. Um. That was probably the extent of it. But oh, I mean, you never give up, do you? N n n no, we don't. A a a and you and your p p p p pappy are going to learn that fucking soon, asshole. Bye bye. <laughs> and uh, he's going to try and push him again. All right. Ooh, that's a good one. Oh, oh. God bless. Ragnar, as you do it again, he grabs you. Oh, the fight's not over just yet. I'm having so much fun. Now, right. come on and join me down here. 
Uh, and he's basically, you can tell he's going to try to pull you down with him uh, oh, when try. it gets his turn. Babs gets one more, one more chance. All right. He like grabbed your boot by the bottom of it, basically. Damn, All this, right. is, this is fucking Shove Fest 2024. Shove Face 2024. Oh, God. I've been rolling so crap. All right, let's, let's do it. 15 is what you gotta beat. Oh. Oh, it is a one that you oh rolled. Oh my god. But you can't um, fail and it's, checks. No, you can because it's uh, it's technically an attack roll. I, or no, it's not. It's not an attack roll. It's a check, ain't it? Huh, that's an awkward position to be in. Uh, hold on. Roll 2d6 for me. That's how we're okay. gonna determine this. I do have one more, one more trick up my sleeve. You succeeded, this but this is going to determine what happens. Yes! Okay. I'll say with an 11, because that that's means something good happens. It, it functions as you plan. As you kick him for a brief moment, he yanks you down with him like he is going to fucking thrash you under the tires. But you, because you are flying, are able to just kind of kick him with your other foot. And he goes boom, tumbling out the back of the rumbler. Ba -ba, ba -ba -ba. See ya. Bye, dipshit. <laughs> um, you see him rolling and rolling and rolling, and then uh, you see him stop, basically landing on all fours. Uh, and then we'll get to what happens after. Uh, is that it for Babs? Uh, yeah, he's out of movement. He's used his damn action surge. Yeah. All right. Uh... Next is Armed. Yeah, uh, Armed and Yars are just gonna wait and not do anything until, well, you know, if the guy comes back, they'll they'll fight him. But else, that's that. All right. Um, top of the order, we end tonight's session uh, with Fafnir. Its mouth sputtering with fire. Um, roaring out violently um, before suddenly <laughs> this burst of fire shoots forward in a line in front of its mouth, uh, kind of like in this picture, uh, tearing up the snow in front of it. Um, and then it moves upward uh, to line itself up with the car. Uh, its mouth again puttering with with fire as Ragnar gets to his feet and you guys see him begin charging towards the rumbler again at speed it's not over yet um and that is where we will end tonight's session because it is over right now mm -hmm. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and watch the rest of all of our videos. And stay tuned to the Adventurer's Land.